Hello. Hey, Brandon. Hey. You look, you look goofy as hell. <laughs> what? Well, I got my face painted for the case race <laughs> tomorrow. We're not doing that. <laughs> we are face painting. Uh, Yak, presented by Roback, Roback.com. Promo code Yak. 20% off your first purchase. Q-Zips, polos, hoodies, joggers, shorts, all of it. Roback.com. Promo code Yak. Hello, it's Thursday. I was worried about it being too plain, and I think it is a little too plain. You think your David Bowie face paint is too plain? Well, this whole entire side of the face is not painted. Yeah, uh, but you're, you're, the entire side of your head is. Let's see it. You have to. T- we'll turn your head. Okay. Can you not turn oh, your neck? Oh, oh. no, no. I'm sorry. The other side too, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. She, got, she got both sides of your head. You I think like you're it. enjoying your lips being painted. Ugly you woman. Are. I don't. I don't mind that. You have the lips of someone who would ask for a. I feel right. Ranch manager. I feel pretty good. <laughs> I didn't, but I didn't know. So my other teammates are gonna go in there with a plan. Yeah. So we're, we're yeah, they're gonna go in there with a plan. Yeah. I you guys came up with a theme after I sat down and got Ziggy Stardust. No, you I mean, got the could, great could, white we could, duke. We could, we could change. Version. We could change plans. Who are you? I thought you were Elton John. I'm David Bowie. Oh, David Bowie. My bad. Yeah. By the way, Tim Hitchings is here. Oh, what's oh, up? Hey. <laughs> we should have said that. Hey, Tim. Tim Hitchings, the legend himself, not a loser. Fucking well. Winner. We'll uh, find we'll, out. We'll, that'll be decided, yeah. We decided. So, uh, Ronan Seth, did you guys hear this story? Do you know the 20 Root Beer I story? I heard it off air, but I don't think I got the full telling of it. But there was a record broken, from my understanding. Accidental record record broken. So, Tim Hitchings just tweeted at me randomly one day. He said, ask TJ about the time I drank 20 Root Beers at Cheesecake Factory. And we asked TJ, and TJ said that, it wasn't even like Tim Hitchings was going for a record or talked about. It. He just realized it was free refills, and he drank 20 root beers at Cheesecake. When did you start keeping count, though? There was nothing random about that tweet. What? It, I what? was replying to you. You were worried about your diet and whether you should drink root beer. Oh, yes, that wasn't random. You're right. Corrected. How's the diet going? Well, look at me. I look fucking like a Greek god. It does look beautiful. Yeah. Come coming on. In, coming in hot, Tim. Listen, it? I judge my diet. If I can get one person saying I look good a day, that means I'm on the right path. Has anybody said it today? That's one of your lighter black shirts. Yeah, Erica said it. She was like, you look good. Mm. She said, you're, you're melting away. I have a question, though. Oh, Brandon, why did you do David Bowie? <laughs> yeah, like you didn't and start drinking. To us at all. Well, we'll ask questions, but yes, yeah, start drinking. Have you, you've seen David Bowie in concert. You're old enough, right? Okay, Tim, just relax. <laughs> Secondly, I sat down, y'all didn't have a plan for me, and I said to the face painter, hey, what do you feel like painting? She, she said David Bowie. She said Ziggy Stardust. Oh. That face painter thinks you're bisexual. Remember the dude whose dad, who he found out his dad fucked David Bowie on? Yeah, it, yeah. That was an all-time well, post. She recognized me from the, the cat the cat's face last time and she, she didn't knew, recognize you from that she just met you she knew that i had an Multiple open times. mind and would let yeah, her do what, what, whatever she wanted wait what's that that's a these this is the right one right i can just drink 20 of these yeah wait what is that those this are little guys one? so you're gonna drink 20 of these while we yak 20 of these or 20 of these 20 of those oh yeah it doesn't matter 20 no well you i said 20? that you don't have to drink 12 ounces in every because it's it's true to form cheesecake like it's not like they're pouring 12 ounce can in every glass because there's ice I don't even know if I could do 20 root beer barrels the candy. Are you nervous? Of course I'm nervous. How many Look did at you- my hand shaking right Yeah. Now. All right, see, that's good. That counts as one in my opinion. I agree. You're, yeah. let it, you're letting top. me off the hook. No, you could go a little more, yeah. I'm supposed to be drinking these all day. It's stews. Now I got to drink it in like an hour and a half. Oh, it's less than so that's that. That's not 45 yeah, that's not minutes. Not <laughs> <laughs> this is a short You got to be out here by five, brother. Well, get to drinking. I can't believe you're going no straw. I agree with. Ice is gonna I agree be with hanging against your face. So, yeah, what's the against do? the face? Just trying to get the fizz out of it. Okay. Think about it. Do you think that you can do this? I just did. When did you? <laughs> when, when? When was? When, what year was it that you first did this? This was probably about ten years ago. TJ and I oh. were, were doing Babe Ruth baseball. I used to uh, prep all the fields, and uh, after a hot day's work of of baseball, we went to. To cheesecake. cheesecake. But again, when in the night did you realize a record was going to happen? I, 
don't think that was a you, record. You, put, you, just, it, you went for it. it. Just, you just put down 12 I was and say, thirsty. I'm going to I was very thirsty. <laughs> you ever had root beer when you're thirsty? It's oh, delicious. It's, good. it's a good. It's Best. A, All right, so you could just drink, yeah. Okay. Are you thirsty now? You I haven't be. had anything but um, Stella Cold Brew Coffee since Here 9 a.m. Love it. Company, company man. Yeah. Company man. Yeah, that's, Good man. Take notes, Sasquatch. <laughs> yeah, I actually drink that all the time. Um, what, <laughs> <laughs> what should I get my face painted as? Whatever you want, brother. The pizza. I thought you guys were doing pizza, hot dog, hamburger. Brandon's David Bowie. I think that's that's David funny. Bowie has had all three. Yes. <laughs> uh, you find that Reddit post, TJ, the guy who's who posted it, he was like, Look at this, my dad with David Bowie in the seventies. And everyone was like starting. Uh, your dad fucked David Bowie, dude. <laughs> he was just like, No, that's not true. It's a badge of honor, honestly. Yeah. I think that's not a bad uh For sure. Those subreddits of just like I think it's old school cool is what it's called. It's just par- it's kids bragging how hot their parents were. Yeah. Very strange. Yes, very strange. Your parents were probably hot as fuck though. Oh, Nick Straight Dad? I just talked to your dad. He was looking good today. He was looking good on Friday when I saw him. Oh yeah, look yes. at that. My dad with David Bowie in vacation in Greece, nineteen eighty eight. Shared a yeah, bicycle. Buddy. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, Hopefully he was fucking David Bowie. Yeah, he definitely was. But not getting fucked by, I think, is mine. Oh. My dad was excited to meet you guys at Rough and Rowdy. I've met him multiple times. Again, he was excited to meet you guys again. <laughs> okay. I met Devlin for the first time. He had a good looking uh friend with him. Yeah. John. Yeah, very tanned. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they just got back from Mykonos. I still <laughs> Riding around on their motorcycle. <laughs> They're at Lindsay Lohan. Uh, TJ, I resort. think you can update the counter, bro. Yeah, he's had one. One. He's one down. One can or one? You had one. One glass. I'm counting one. glasses because that's what cheesecake would do. All right. So it's refills. Have I'm you being... ever seen the glasses in cheesecake? They're not that big, I don't think. Oh, they're big. Well, well, why didn't are. you go to Cheesecake and get one of their glasses and bring it in? I'm not that stupid. Think yeah. how big that glass is. I'd never get through 20 of those. Oh, you're the one that said you did it in the first place. Oh, I think that counts as one. A glass with ice counts as one. Wait, said hoping you did for it. a smaller Brandon, glass. Are you are yeah. you doubting? I'm not doubting the man at all. I just I want him to live up to his potential. Going for the record. I want him to live up to the legend that I've heard about. So Sass, what are you getting? I don't know. Should I do pizza? Yeah. Or what's another idea? What's something else you could get? Let's go biblical. Biblical? Yeah. What about Joshua, Judges, and Ruth? That wouldn't be bad. What would Ruth be? A woman. Abe. A harlot. You know that Bob Barker... Ruth was a harlot? No, I'm confusing her with Mary Magdalene. Mm. You know Bob Barker was alive for 477 of Babe Ruth's home runs? What? But just to make sure, Bob Barker has not died. No. Okay, yeah. Yeah, but Babe Ruth is not going to hit any more home runs. That's also true. That's your opinion. Yeah, uh, I, I... Yeah. Bob Bar- I can see that. What's he, 95? He's, fun. He's uh, 99. Sass, get the crucifix down here. Well, 99 years <laughs> ago. Hell no. Was <laughs> He's so sick. That's half Babe Ruth's career. Sass, get that guy from the end of Inglorious Bastards. Yeah. He <laughs> Ruth hit 476 home runs. That's Bob Barker. Barker was born. Bob Barker, what a G. What a fucking legend. Oh. Him into Victor Newman, probably the biggest one-two legend punch in the history of TV. Also, Who the G- fuck is Victor Newman? Yeah, you can't just, no, who's Victor Newman? What? No, I, have, I have no idea who Victor Newman is, huh. thus making them nowhere Newman? close to the best one-two punch that ever existed. Hold on, hold on, time. Emmy! No, she doesn't know Victor Oh, no, this he's getting, okay. Oh, I see what he's doing. Oh, shit. No, uh, Kelly's coming, too. Oh. You know who Victor Newman is? <laughs> no, who the hell is Victor Newman? <laughs> no, no, she doesn't know who Victor Newman is. Who the fuck is Victor Newman? You know who Victor Newman is? <laughs> Even Tim doesn't know who Victor Nobody Newman. in here knows Victor Newman. Yeah. This who is crazy. Fuck is Victor Newman? He, he's the best one two He's one of the coolest television. motherfuckers in the history of the world. He's Victor Newman from Young and the Restless. Nobody? Why the fuck would Ebony know that? Right. Why, Why would any of us know, know that? Black people love Victor Newman. I ain't gonna lie. My mom knew who that is. I'm not gonna take it off. <laughs> All right, Kelly's coming in too. Hold on. I She flamed you. Kelly, do you know who Victor Newman is from Young and the Restless? Oh, no, fuck no. You guys are not. TJ's mom knows. You didn't stay home from school and watch Price is Right and Young and the Restless? I watched Price is Right and Chips. What? Why Chips? That was what was on after Price is Right. I'm not crazy. Uh, Victor Newman is a, is a very famous person in this. In this, No? I don't, I don't know. 
Bob Barker is significantly larger. Yes. Of course he is. They're not a one-two punch. There were a one-two punch in Mississippi where I had Bob Barker at 10 and Victor Newman at 11. And this is not crazy. I'm not the only person that feels like this. Okay. Uh, Kelly, President Kelly, President-elect? Yes, You've been I'm inaugurated? Not. No, not yet. I'm sure the insurrection is going to get in the way of that. So oh, we'll no. See. We'll see. So oh. I wanted Kelly to come in because I... Um, I do miss being around Kelly every day because I have a lot of questions for her. True, there's a lot of stuff going on in the Taylor Swift world you haven't been able to. Yeah, so I, I've it. kept a running tally of questions that you guys can also chime in on that I wanted to ask Kelly when I saw her again. Love it. Um, should I just fire it off? This goes back like off. a month and a half. I'm curious, like uh, on the scale of like w- one to ten, how rude are these questions? Not that rude. Okay. What are they all about? What did you Taylor think Swift? of the Barbie movie? Oh, <laughs> well, no, that actually is the first question. Did you see in the Barbie movie the controversial yeah. map that doesn't uh, respect what was it Taiwan? Maybe. Whoa. Any oh, comments on that? I did see something like that. So do you disavow? Well, I mean, it's a fake map, and none of it was real. They had oh, so LA those people don't exist. Country. Talk about Israel. No, it was. Uh, you find that TJ the fake map that she. Yeah, I, to be honest, I didn't. I didn't look into that. I didn't look into whatever that that was because it was a fake. Well, that's map. convenient. People were saying like, oh, they they left whatever off the map. I think they said they left the Philippines off the map. I was like, okay, but the map is fake, and half the world isn't on the map anyway. So why are the Philippines mad when like half of the other world is not on it either? I don't know. The Philippines were supposed to be on the map. They weren't on the map. I don't know if they were, suppo- were they supposed all time. to be on the map, though. That's a lot of people. Favorite movie of all time. Can I tell you something that made me really happy over the weekend? Did you see Erica saw the movie? Made a grid post about it. Loved it so much. Wow. Yeah. So watch your mouth. About the oh, what the fuck? Not you. Not you. Not you. I just oh, no. was looking Speak over at you. You're, you're good. Uh, we gotta get, we gotta get you in a true. convertible in Dallas. Look at this. <laughs> world map. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, Philippines. So they don't don't exist. China, well, that's a crazy that's world the map. The map anyway. That's the map. No, 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 no. About. It's China. <laughs> Come on. I didn't realize that was the map. Yeah, yes, know. yes. Like that's Fuck. what I'm saying. But it also says what? Uh, what is it? I can't read that far. What it does it say? World map. It says world Featuring, map. No, no. But what did the tweet say? Asia. Oh, I don't know. Featuring Beijing. China responds to Barbie movie featuring map that supports Beijing territory claims ruled illegal. That's exactly what okay. that map Wow. Is. Right. So, like, it's something. I'd be more mad about that mid ass Barbie. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Do you disavow? I don't. No. I don't disavow. I stand by that map. That map is silly. That ugly chick's in the way. <laughs> what about the uh, violence at the Barbie movies? The violence at the Barbie movie. Well, I only saw one video of violence, and uh, I thought that I, I don't know what happened there. I wish I knew more about it because sometimes you gotta sometimes you gotta hit somebody in the face, but it doesn't have to be mar- like in the Barbie movie. Okay. You know what I mean? I think um, it just happened to happen at the Barbie movie. You also said Taylor Swift's smart girls listen to her. Yeah. So that means anyone who doesn't listen to Taylor Swift is dumb. So we're not mm-hmm. empowering women. No, I wouldn't say that. I don't think that was an exclusionary tweet. I think that was just saying if you're smart, it's likely that you listen to Taylor Swift. If you're dumb, you can also listen to Taylor Swift. I didn't say dumb girls can't. Do you consider yourself smart? Yes. So what about this tweet? On Ain't wrong. August Sorry. 20, <laughs> what about this tweet on August 25th, 2013? Oh, oh. Not watching the VMAs, but it sounds like Miley was rolling face, T-Swift is sucking dick as usual, and JT continues to be perfect. This tweet came up during the election. <laughs> I told you I had some questions. No, oh, no, no, you're right. <laughs> this tweet came up during the elections. Is this Mike Francesa's Diet Coke, by the Yeah, way? you can drink it. <laughs> That's amazing. No, oh, I'm it's not going to drink Kate's Diet Coke. <laughs> it's crazy. Where is she? I don't um, know. I don't know. This tweet came up during the elections. Tommy showed it to me. Didn't use it during the campaigns as like a smear thing. I have no idea what that tweet is about. I, I'm dead serious. I have no idea. Never was there a time where I didn't like Taylor Swift, especially in 2013. And I love Miley Cyrus. <clears throat> and I love Swift Justin Timberlake. is sucking dick as usual. Wow. That, that doesn't make wow. any sense. Can you say that? Is oh. that a real tweet? Is that, or that something that, that she really no, it's, a real tweet. it's a real it's tweet. It's a real tweet. But I, I had no explanation for it. I have no idea. I, the only thing I noticed that it, it is, that is the year I graduated college and that was at night. And I might have just been drunk mm. and being stupid. Well, you know what they say. Drunk words are sober thoughts. <laughs> Ooh, wait a minute. I guess Sucking so. dick doesn't. That's not a, that's a bad I don't, thing. It's I don't good. know. But as usual, about, implies that that's all she does. Is no, shit. to be fair, no, I usually if I'm using that, no, no, no. If I'm using that expression in real life, I haven't used that expression in a long time. But that just means like, oh, she sucks dick, meaning like she sucks. Like you suck so bad, you suck dick. That's so not literally. Expression. Not literally. Because no. some were so the follow up. Yeah, I could question. be like, oh, like Dan, like you know, blah, 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 you suck dick. Like right. you suck. The follow up question would be, do you think Taylor Swift is having so many relationship problems because she stopped sucking dick? Um. No, that I don't th- could happen. You know, is a, you know what is a new thing that people have been saying about Swifties? And I, yeah. I hate this narrative, but it is kind of funny. They say that Swiftie girls give blowjobs with teeth. 
<laughs> oh, that's mean. Which is a mean thing to say. Mean. It's a mean thing to say. So I guess that's I don't mean. know. Brandon, what what's your you, you look? I just seems like a, that's a lot of people to generalize about sucking dick with teeth. But I could actually see it. I it know. Kind of fits. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. I don't I don't really know where that comes from. Stadiums but full of of people that suck dick with yeah. teeth. Hardy beef. What does that mean? Not use teeth. No, my God. No, no. Slop it up. But what does that mean? Like if you. D- like I, I know Tim. that you can't, <laughs> Tim's laughing. I know you can't be using. I know you can't be using teeth during blowjobs. But like, do what, you though? What does uh? I don't know. What kind of girl? What does it look like for a girl to be like? You know what I mean? Like, what girl? Zoom in. What TJ? makes a girl look like that? <laughs> don't do it. What makes a girl oh. look like? Oh that? no! <laughs> oh, <laughs> toothy head. head. Damn That's it! That's my guy. Do That's my guy. Do you use teeth? But I'm serious. Like, what makes a girl look like she gives a blowjob with teeth? Like, what is? What are the qualities? I'm I don't curious. Know. Big big teeth. Big teeth. Yeah, big, big teeth. teeth. The okay. only answer. Sorry, really. All right, big teeth. She's got big like teeth. Francesca would use like teeth. That. Big Francesca ass teeth. Francesca for sure would use some big teeth. Yeah. She's got great teeth. For sure. Um, he looks exactly the same. Hasn't changed. Hasn't changed. Like I've never seen him standing up though. I feel like oh, he's always never. sitting whenever I see him. I was mad he didn't do the yeah. bat pose for all the pictures. You ever seen that? Does he do that? He, he does. He, he, you pull it up. He holds an invisible bat in all his pictures. See, it's everyone needs something for pictures. Some guys do like the boxing fist. Yeah. yeah. I kind of do. Che does the point. He does like a number one. That bothers me. Yeah. I do it's a piece when he all takes the time. pictures. Peace is good. Peace is universal. I also would love to just stop the every guy doing the arms around. Look yeah. at that. Look at the invisible bat. See so that? He's holding the bat. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, he's doing it. Got a bat. How do you get into that? You take one photo and you look really good doing it? He does kind of look good doing it. I've I've gotten worse at getting my photo taken. I've turned my head too far back. It's like all, my nostrils are where like my eyes should be. Photos. <laughs> well, I don't know why. Do you I have don't some know. Photos like that. Yeah, you do. But oh, does it make your make your neck look bigger? Is that why you do it? I don't. I don't know you, why. Want your I neck do. to look bigger. I don't want my neck to look People bigger. Look jacked, you know. You're very insecure yeah. about your tiny ass neck. Oh yeah. fuck! <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> it, it's, it's covered by the entire mic right now. <laughs> yeah, you can't see it on either side. Did you Nobody's finish ever three seen or are you on? You on three? He's on three. This is three. How is it? Is anybody else going to go get their face paint? Right. Oh, oh yeah, has to, but he doesn't know what to get. Kate's Kate's there right now. Oh, that's Kate's Kate's right there right now. in there right now. Uh, Kelly, should we continue? Yeah, absolutely. This was uh, when there were the fires in Sicily. <laughs> Kelly wrote, "I saw this on the news in London. Pretty crazy, dire situation in Sicily that's been happening at least over fire. a week. A, that was a typo. Fire situation is what." Oh, pre- pretty like that was an awesome situation. situation. Yeah, pretty fire ass. So you basically <laughs> inserted yourself into a fire in Sicily being like, remember when I was in London? <laughs> yes, I did do that. But I also really wasn't lying. I saw that on the news and I said, that's crazy. I haven't seen that on the news at home. And then I got home and a week later, we're seeing the news. So a week ahead of time, they're crying for help over when there. When you were in and London. Now, yeah, when I was in London. So now we're now paying attention. Somebody should go help them. Were you doing anything to help? I would, no, I was on a plane flying back to the U.S. Awareness. It's already too late. Yeah. Awareness. Awareness, Awareness exactly. Did you do anything for the fires in Hawaii? <sighs> what are no, you doing for the black wow. I'll tell you what, though. I. Uh, no, but she donated I, a lot to Ukraine. <laughs> <laughs> a lot. I donated a lot to Ukraine. No, I, I stopped thinking about visiting, just like uh, just like they told me. Oh, wow, that's brave. They said, don't make this your vacation. Remember they said that? They were like, you this is that? not your vacation. I said, oh, I'm taking it off the list for at least a year. Okay. So that's I think actually that's, huge. Yeah, that is huge. It's huge pledge. Yeah, I'm in a big travel year right now. Are you? Yeah, because I haven't been anywhere in my whole life, so I'm trying to knock it all out quick while I can. What? Where else are you going? Where you been? You went what? to London. I'm going Wait, to, we, been to Tokyo. Are you knocking it Tokyo out quick? Once. What do you have planned? Well, nothing. I just want to go to all these places. I've wanted to go forever, and so now I've uh, I went oh, to Tokyo a couple years ago. This is your first presidential year. move to just go yeah. on vacation. It's first year as president, you're just going to travel. I'm just going to go He's on going vacation. to check her. Yeah. No, no. I've had I've had trips planned. I've had trips planned for a long time. I had the London trip was back in July. I'm going to uh, I'm going on a writer's retreat. This is actually interesting, and I think maybe you guys will like this. Maybe not though, based on your face right now. But writers? I'm going on this writer's retreat. Well, we also have Kate walking in with us. Hey, Kate. I didn't even know Kate was Ice here. Kate. Kate, are you the beef? Hey. Right, <laughs> 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 Sass, go on. So good. What am I gonna get? What g- get the hot dog pizza? Do what I did. Just say paint whatever you want. No, she, that was a text after you went in there. They said, make sure you know what you want beforehand. So she must have side oh. text complained about you. Oh, that sucks. Why not ask the president of the New York office? What yeah. You? What should what's say? Oh, oh. Space oh my God. What? actually did text that. 
Yeah. Damn. <laughs> As I was sitting in the chair. Then, like, to, she com- did complain about you a lot. What's your, what's your vibe? Like, what do you, I know that you do the Joker, like, every time. Let's not go things or people. Let's go patterns. Ooh. What about checkerboard. a trout? What about, yeah. like, a rainbow trout? Oh, oh. Rainbow, rainbow trout. Rainbow fish. Rainbow fish. I want to do something very minimal. Why not rainbow fish? It's so pretty. Hot dog. Braveheart. I mean, hot dogs as minimal as it gets. Yeah. What about Waldo? This is glasses, right? Yeah, yeah, glasses, but then, like, maybe a little bit of a hat and, like, you know. Pinstripes. Eyes. Yankee pinstripes. <laughs> So much pain. Yeah, you just don't want to wash it off. Yeah, That's on, the problem, this. right? It's a pain in the ass, and it gets all in my eyes. <laughs> just what go with a red nose, then. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> wow, you're gonna violate the pizza's going to be the most pain imaginable. <laughs> well, what else would I do? Get something <laughs> I guess, angry. I guess That's pizza's right. the only option. Get a hot dog. <laughs> what is a hot dog gonna look like? <laughs> I don't well, like hot dog. No, hot dog, dude. Hot dog Jay, Google hot dog face paint. On his cheek right here, yeah. going into his mouth. I'll do whatever you don't do. I'll probably get checkerboard. You're going to do checkerboard? Maybe our pinstripes, whatever get you Get Argyle. Do. Or go Paisley. Go Houndstooth. Plaid. Houndstooth. 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 That's a lot of paint, too. <laughs> That's a lot of paint. Get the Tennessee end zone. Chevron. Oh, look. Oh, that looks... <laughs> That's terrible. <looking. laughs> what the hell? The one on the top, on the top left. Yeah, right there. Wait, what is? How is that, that guy? On? Yeah, get yes, that. What about that? That, that thing's coming. <laughs> that's a dick. <laughs> oh, how about the burger? Oh, oh yeah, there you go. Oh my god. Are oh, you got this, Sass? We believe in you. Kiss. What are you guys doing? Do okay. the anonymous. Well, I'm telling you. Well, I'll do musicians. <laughs> yeah. All right, that's smart. Do Bob Marley. No. Oh, I'm gonna okay. do Kurt Cobain. That's three. Close the door. What do you live in a barn? True. Uh, what's your writer's retreat? Oh, yes, I'm going. It's hosted by uh, this author, Kat Marnell, who I really like. She wrote the book, How to Murder Your Life. It's um, it's a really Not good a book. a good or a bad thing, murdering it's, your life? Oh, no, it was good. Well, she used to work It's like at, sucking dick. Well, Rico's yeah. got, Rico just went in. She used to work at Count Condé Nast. She, uh, you know, she, like, was... So you're like a drug problem, all this other stuff. She's now come on the other side of it, whatever. She's hosting this whole thing. It's in Greece, and I booked it back in February, and I've been looking forward to it since February. So you're paying, f- paying someone money to tell you how to write? No, it's like a, it's like a, it's kind of like a group, and we're all gonna go and we'll hang out, and it'll be creative and interesting. I'm interested, and well, I'm going by myself. Creativity retreat. She's gonna. It's come not back. a retreat yeah. for writers. It's a writers retreat. Process. Writers go. Yes. Like-minded people. Yeah. So Girl power. Is. Pretty much. Yeah. So Are there I'm interested. Any guys. I don't know. Maybe I don't know who's going. I don't, I know nothing about it. I'm going by myself. I know that I paid for it. It was a big uh, step out of my comfort zone type thing that I. You don't have to tell us you paid for. We can assume that you paid for it. Well, no. I mean, like it's meaning like I uh, I actively chose to do this. I didn't just get like you know they didn't ask me to do it or anything. They didn't, I, they I didn't read your out. take down a Mean Girl pod no. and like oh we need her. <laughs> like we need her to come <laughs> through. No. Are you gonna wield your power to hurt Mean Girl at all? Um, I don't know where. I mean. No, well, they're not here. So. They're not here. Yeah. Although, although Jordan did get a get a, get a minute on stool scenes where she really stuck it to me, told me she was voting for Tommy. So Ooh. Oh. she really got me Nasty. there. She really got me. Nice. Uh, uh, a little Sasquatch's wallet. Uh, <laughs> oh, <laughs> look how much! That? Look how much money is in it. That's what a lot fuck? of fucking money. How That's neat. like a Jersey Jerry wallet. Oh my God, I don't even want to go into it. And they all look like the same type of bills. You just look twenties. Is Please. it wrong if we all take bets on how much is in there and then you'll never if we tell all us? Take one. Oh yeah, let's They'll see. never tell us. Let's guess. Is it wrong to see and find out. I think it's wrong to see, but <laughs> how much can we take out without him noticing? A lot. Okay, it's not just twenties. Oh, a lot of ones. Oh. Oh. Broke boy. Been going to strip clubs. <laughs> Broke Yikes. boy. You put the twenty on the outside. You know. Yeah, that. he. Well, that's how they were. They were kind of like stacked in there like a club sandwich. Maybe, he left it. Th- maybe it he went to purpose. a strip club. Maybe he went to a strip club. Might have a over the weekend. Life. We know from the Yak Sass hates strippers. Yeah, he does. Yeah. Have Elfax? That's true. That's yeah. yeah, he doesn't even get hard. Or does he so just only hate strippers in this room? Ooh, I don't know. Oh, why would you hate strippers in this room? This is a great stripping room. Well, weren't there strippers here and he didn't like Oh, them? Kate, have you not ordered a stripper again? <laughs> I genuinely, I I would have genuinely that, wanted to ask her to come back tonight for the case race. It would cost you so much money. I could I know if she needed like a new couch. Again. Oh, yeah, she would have taken Can you. Can you buy her a living room? A sectional. Okay. <laughs> a very high end <laughs> sectional couch. Um, I knew I couldn't afford it. Um, Kelly, yeah. next up, mm-hmm. the crane that fell in Hell's Kitchen. Mm. Oh, yeah. You said, this has me concerned. Can we do a Barstool Sports roll call? 
I'll be honest. When I first saw that, I thought it was the crane that was right right outside of our, our own oh. office. Oh. But then when I did more research, it was in Hell's Kitchen. Although a lot of people that we that we Me? have around here live in Hell's Kitchen. So that was oh. my follow up question. That's I was still concerned. Top three people you wouldn't want to die. Top three people you would want to die. Ooh, good question. Good question. You do have to answer. Yeah. Of okay. Right. Yes. Of course. Okay. Mm. These are all look. See. It says on the top. Can you read that? Yeah. Has Some to answer. questions for Kelly. Mandatory Some questions. questions. For I Kelly. believe it. I believe it. Let's see. People I wouldn't want to die. Just do wood. Wood? Yeah. yeah. We, it, yeah. Okay. Because the wooden is just like, you know, Dave, Erica, and, and Why wouldn't somebody you want else with it? Uh, it affect your life at Dave. Power. Yeah. Just, you know, to make sure I still have a job. That's, okay. my, that's my main all right. concern. So Sarah? I want all those people to stay alive. Smart. And then um, would you? As far as death, who I want to die, I'm trying to think who would be the funniest. I mean, Nate might be number one. Like that would be yeah. like Bad he luck, would, Nate. He'd be coming back from the like he would come out of the grave just to complain about how he got killed by the crane. So I, I would appreciate that. Yep. And I think I might just take him one, two, three. Okay. Yeah. Good answer. Thank you. Um, three different cranes. Yeah, three different cranes. Yeah. You said you were going to do an MRI to see your list of ailments. Oh yeah, I did. What's your list of ailments? Want to hear about it? Yeah. Did you yes. want to see something crazy? So I did this thing. I actually, so I was going to do a whole post about it, no joke, but I didn't because Kim Kardashian did it also, and she's getting ripped apart for doing it. People got big mad. Because it's like, it's not included with insurance. Like, you had to pay for it. I paid like, a, you know, whatever. And I uh, I just haven't been to the doctor or anything in like 10 years. I didn't have health insurance for a long time. I'm really lazy about it. I care not enough about my body, whatever. So this came up, and a friend of mine did it and said that it was actually pretty informative. It's something that you're able to like see potential aneurysms or you know early early stages of cancer things like that just rules it out does everything in your body it, it's a full body mri scan 55 minutes you sit in there wow. and oh, uh, too much dick skin on your teeth and so exactly <laughs> that was that's actually the number one thing that's the number one thing that hey, you listen to taylor swift it's the number one thing they had seen this a lot <laughs> i'm gonna show you i'm gonna show you this i do not want this posted online but I will show this to you, and okay. you can hold it up. Okay. But I don't want people having this. Wait, but the show's going to get up. People will see. Just it. here, I'll I'll read it. No, no, no. I just want you. To, you can see the video. Did I send you? I can look at it. Is this you? That's me. That's my body. I posted my brain online, but I didn't What's, want my. Look at your eyeball. You know, I know. the worst part. <laughs> What's the worst part? Nothing is bad about it. I just don't. I feel weird about my like whole skeleton being online. Do you have a uh, ailments? I've got a couple things. Hey, this is no the cancer. craziest thing ever. I know. No cancer, so all fine. A couple, I a couple little this. things. I know. Everybody's making fun of me. I would have done a whole thing and been informative, but I didn't want to get ripped apart. Sure. Like the clink. Was that another one down? Sure. Four? <sighs> Look at that thing. Isn't that weird? That's my body. kind of, yeah. That could be anybody. Did you find out anything that you were anybody. like, oh, yeah. that makes sense? Like, yes, I have like a, I have a hernia that I was oh. like, oh. that makes fucking sense. Yeah. Oh, yeah. well, you have a penis. Yeah, I saw the cock. Yeah. <laughs> you saw that? You saw that? I saw your cock and I didn't biggest, know what to say. That was the biggest yeah. discovery of the yeah, day. The biggest. Yeah, that was yeah. the biggest discovery. Okay, a couple more questions. Weird, right? Last, last two uh, that's questions. That's like mesmerizing. I know. Um, I know. Did, Did you, you know that Queen Elizabeth had two cousins that she basically, that were oh, invalid? No. And uh, is that invalid or right? Invalid. Invalid? In, invalid. No. What does that mean? Couldn't, they, they, I think they were. Invalid, is that a, isn't that a Their brains were dead. They were mistakes. I don't know if invalid is like the right word. It went wrong. Well, and that, then that's, I think, a right, okay. medical term. Uh, but I yeah, they had, they had, no. you didn't? I don't think so, no. So they, they had them, two cousins uh, had brain issues. I, I don't think they could talk. They put them in homes, and they told the whole world that they died. Oh, and they what? both lived to like their eighties. Kind of smart. Pretty fucked up, though. And that's well, your queen. Is it fucked up, or is it protecting them from the masses making fun of them, calling them in- invalids, like you? Well, no, that oh, was the medical kidding. definition back then. Back then, I'm not. I don't. I don't. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if that's fucked Sash up. That's just got white face. <laughs> What the, the are you the moon? Is he a ghoul? <laughs> did you get moon? <laughs> so I dead? like turtles. Oh, no, I did Bob Dylan, Rolling Thunder. Oh, okay. Yeah. What? I like it. It's what we said. We said we were going to do musicians. <laughs> you said you were, that. That was the last thing I heard. You were kidding. No. Wait, is Rico doing a musician? <laughs> no, you, that's what you guys <laughs> told me to do. <laughs> What's Rico doing? I told him I said we were doing musicians. Oh, okay. Does she know what Bob Dylan, Rolling Thunder was? Hell no. I don't know what it is. What is it? white like a mime? That's what it looks. What he looks like in it. He wears white face paint. Pull it up. You is it identical? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> if she did black on the sides, which is not what he did. Yeah, okay, why? here we go. I got the yeah, post. Church, just... Queen Elizabeth had two secret cousins. Oh, what is this about? Severe disabilities were hidden from the public. Nerissa and Catherine Bowes Ly- Lyon were the daughters. 
blah, blah, blah. Both girls were born with severe learning and intellectual disabilities. In 1963, a magazine called Burke's Peerage claimed that Nerissa had passed in 1940 and that Catherine had passed in 1961. However, in 1987, it was revealed that Catherine was still alive and Nerissa had died in 1986. What do you think about this? Damn. You know, I need more information because I don't I don't trust it coming out of your mouth, number one. Number two. It's I off the internet. Don't it's off the internet. No, I know, but I'm saying, like, whatever source you're looking at, I don't know. I don't know. I need more information. Before Check was sent to the hospital every year for $125. What if you did find out the queen was a bad person? Like, maybe her son I was probably a probably wouldn't be surprised. Yeah. <laughs> okay. If it was like she's an actual piece of shit. I think that she probably took a lot of sl- a lot of flack for shitty things. And I think also that, like, I don't know. I don't ever think that anything that happened there was just her. Like, I don't think that she was running around being like, so I she's want not this, smart I want enough? this, I want this. Yeah. No, no, no. I think that there's a team of people and she's, you know. Sounds like she wasn't able different. to make her own decisions. She was a puppet on a string. I think, uh, I think... Not a not a puppet, but certainly a part of the group. Could Taylor she's Swift do something to make you think she's a shithead, a bad person? I've been thinking about this lately, honestly. Uh, I forget what happened the other day. Something happened that I was like, oh, no, I hope that that's not true. Or I hope that Taylor never does something because it would be really hard for me to, like, talk shit. Like, if she did something bad, I can't I can't pretend like she didn't do something bad. You know what I mean? You, you pretend her music is f- good. You just that not care. Be- yeah, you could just not care. And just be like, well, I don't care that she did anything bad. Yeah. Fuck this. Like She's probably rooted. done something yes. bad. Have you ever rooted for her? I'm sure. Have you ever rooted for her professional sports you, team? What bad thing do you think she's done? Murder? Yeah, she's probably murdered. She's probably murdered. Yeah, true. There are those rumors that she and Harry Styles hit somebody with a car. What? What? You guys didn't know about this? Sounds real. A Harry's drunk, bald ass. Drunk driving? There's a, there's a rumor. No, it was like, I don't know. The song Out of the Woods is apparently about it. That's she wrote it a says. song about it? She wrote a song called That's Out of the Woods. Gangster. Is she Key Glock? It's about, a, it's about like a, a when they hit somebody. <laughs> YNG Taylor. <laughs> Yeah, what the fuck? The lyrics of the song are, remember when we hit the brakes too soon, 20 stitches in the hospital room. Oh. That is a good How do you hit the brakes too soon? They were trying to know. kill. Because they were yeah. trying to stab him. Dude, you just by the car like, what the fuck? People say it. People you say trying it. to hit me? <laughs> Mr. Hydroplane. <laughs> Last one I had was, I actually agree with this one. Okay. You said, I'm sorry, but men in flip-flops anywhere but the beach is so gross. Super gross. I And I, I that agree. stemmed from, I was in the airport, and I was leaving the airport, and I saw a man wearing flip-flops. Oh, no, I'm sorry. It wasn't the airport. I was at uh, Penn Station, which was even worse. So, New Jersey Transit, Penn Station. I saw a man get off the train with flip-flops on. And he just, his like feet blended in with the flip flops and it looked like yeah. he had no shoes on at first, which Gross. is what caught my attention. And it really was just repulsive. And I decided then and there, that's it. Maybe but I am guilty. about your own fucking feet. My, uh, my high school boyfriend had flip flops on some, a lot of the time and jeans. He would wear flip flops and jeans. So that's an embarrassing time in my past. Mark Zuckerberg. But I've grown up Johnson. since then. Johnson. Yeah. Yeah. I've grown up since then, though, so I'm glad you're. We'll go here. through airport security with fucking. They have to like kick off flip flops and go through barefoot. It's so fucking gross. I can't. I cannot even think about. What that. about Birkenstocks? I'm not so grossed out by them. I understand that they're like a movement, but I still, you gotta. I feel like. I don't know. If there's, if there's a time where you have to take your shoes off, just wear shoes that you wear socks with. Like you don't have to. You never have to be barefoot unless you're at the beach, right? Like. Mm, yeah. Why do you have to be barefoot? The lake. Well, you know, what bodies of water? Live by a lake. Bodies of water. You don't really don't have to wear shoes at home. Or if you're like out in this Or if you're like a worm farmer. Yeah. On the worm farm, it's that kind of vibe overall. You work in like agriculture. can't afford shoes. If you work in agriculture and all those things, like you can wear no shoes if you want. Well, not when I'm already. But if you live in Sicily and your house burned down. Well, then I think you should definitely put some shoes on. Well, if your shoes are in the house. Yeah, your shoes are in the house. And And all you can afford now is flip-flops. What if you're an invalid and, and you're part of the royal family, but they don't send you shoes? Well, then I think, I mean, I don't know. You're, you're dead anyway, apparently. So do you I need really shoes as well? Me. Oh, they lived for a very long time. No, but uh, the rumor was that they lied and said that they were all dead. So who's yeah. sending them shoes? Well, I don't think the, the invalids lied. No, they had no No, no, no. I, people were lying. So like, you know, Actually, track? that's all they could do is yeah. lie around. So you're saying, like, do these invalids need shoes it's not use anyway? That I, it's making me fa- <laughs> <laughs> It is a bad word, right? I don't know what the word is. I don't know why. I thought it was I a medical it's a definition. Bad I mean, word. Somebody cancel word. Let's just hold on to this one for a little while longer. I think it's a bad word. <laughs> a little while longer. Let's take invalid as far as we can take it. Um, can we get an update here? Or you got to yeah, pee? Five. You got to pee at all? Or? How's your time, Tom? Why are you looking at me like you want to What's happening? He's why are you asking me if I want to pee? Do you want to hope? No, I, <laughs> no, I just, I'm asking hold you. Not to give you the A and W, ass and whooping. <laughs> Keep drinking. <laughs> You've had five fruit beers. I'm concerned beers about you. I can use some more ice. Could you get me some more ice? I'll get you some more ice. Some more ice. Nick, what are you going to do for face paint? Oh, we're going to do musicians. What are you going to do? Probably insane clown posse. Oh, nice. Oh, that's it's smart. empty. That's yeah, a good one. You know, I missed the boat. What musicians could this be? 
Uh, Go pop on some more eyebrows and then uh, you can be dime like. Dimebag Daryl from Pantera. <laughs> oh, yeah. Rest in peace. Yeah. yeah. Well, that was all my questions, Kelly. All right, cool. It's always a treat seeing you. I do miss you. Congratulations. What's, uh, what's, as well. what's New York's diplomatic position on Chicago? Um, hey, you wanted as a, a whole? rivalry? Well, you know, the, the rivalry I feel like is, you know, fun sometimes, but and then it gets too serious. Everything gets too serious too quick. That's what happens. It's even with the election that happened, it got too serious too fast. I'm just getting harassed online right now. People think I'm literally Hillary Clinton. Like, people are talking to me as if I'm going to ruin this company. Then just I have, have no power killed. at all. I don't know how many times I have to say it. Like, this means. <laughs> have them suicided. Have them suicide. All this people means. took that true. poster that Tommy made about yeah. you. And they really like seriously. took it very seriously, and uh, like it was just for fun inside yeah. the office. And yes, the office likes me better than Tommy, and that's all that I care about. So we're going to have to take the nuclear launch codes from you once a month. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Mm-hmm. Honestly, yes. Mm-hmm. No joke. You so you <laughs> want a rivalry or no? I think that as long as we keep the rivalry rivalry light, it will be fun. Otherwise, if it gets too serious, then it's not fun anymore. It was fun. very quick that I left the the office and everyone's like, we fucking hated that guy. Yeah, <laughs> you, hear, you, heard that? you heard all those rumors that everybody was talking <laughs> shit behind your back. I mean, that's fine. I can't do anything about it. I think that uh, was it was it when you left? Or were we not saying that before you left? Uh, the, the door no. was shutting. It was like, <laughs> see you guys, great time. We're still coworkers. I did miss your last day. When was your last day? Did you have like a party? No. It's this. Oh. It's this week. It's this week, kind well, this of. This week is technically yeah, yeah. fast. All right. Well, maybe yeah. we'll whip it up. I don't feel welcome here anymore. Maybe we'll mend fences. That was fast. That maybe everyone will mend maybe fences. Maybe a cookie cake. Yeah. Maybe a cookie do cake. Do you think that? Do you think you cried a little too much about about the act star time? Maybe. No, I don't. You don't think so? No, I don't. Okay. No. If you, then that's fine. I don't at all. Good. Good. I th- no. Do you think fences will be mended from New York to Chicago? Think yeah, I'd hope the so. Will come together. I'd hope so. Okay. And I got no. I got no ill will. I don't either. I'm just sitting here. Listen, I stayed out of that whole thing. I was like, this is not my fight. Yeah. Which is big of me because I love to insert myself. You do like to insert Yeah. <laughs> which I side would you have taken? What? Uh. I, I oh. don't understand why anybody cares about the it at all. But all I, I understand that people have have their their things. And that's and this is your thing. Yeah, we've been doing this for a while. Yeah, I get it. I was more bothered that everyone, when we got Barstool back, it was like, oh, we can work cool. again. It's like, what have we been doing for the last three years? Like, <laughs> every um, single working day. Working every single day. I think everybody was working. I think it came at a time where the the morale inside the New York office was so bad. It was right. just, cause you And also, you you know, we had our big company meeting and you were like, oh, we're headed off to Chicago. Anybody can visit whenever they want and play on all of our games and our basketball courts. Oh, that was Chicago. nice. You thought that was mean? Yeah, it was wait, a little rubbing in our face. I want, I want people to be able to come. It was like the day after Tommy's we got all the week. shitty mismatched chairs and you were like, oh, well, p- peace. We're going to go hang That's out. That's not our what I said. That's kind of how it felt. I said anyone who, like, you should feel welcome to come. You were carrying around a basketball. We're like, where the fuck do I put this? Where do I fucking put this basketball? I think it was just a, it was a rejuvenation. We'll see how long. You know, people people get hyped for a couple days, a couple weeks, and then I'm sure yeah. it'll all settle back in. I think I think the the president of New York has to visit the Chicago. Yeah, office. why don't you? I, do I a, think that I am scheduled to visit the and the Greek office. We need to, to make a big yeah, like a am I am I official diplomatic? Of, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's I, what I did. I invite. Okay, perfect. Only I can't believe like that. Genuine invite was seen as no. I'm, it in I'm busting face. your balls. I'm busting your balls. Okay. Nobody, nobody was like. I would like guy. you to come. But I did see it, and I went, "Oh, please, rub it in our face." I said that in my head. <laughs> <laughs> well, I would. Lo- I'm extending the invite. I, a diplomatic I'd invite. We'll I'd have a fucking big my... ribbon. And then you have ambassadors in each office. Uh, yeah. Well, that I have planned already. I have to spy. Spider is our spies. ambassador, but he also could be a spy. Yeah, he's a spy. Well, you're my spy. ambassador. Spider was texting me. <laughs> Spider was Definitely texting me on the side. Spider was voting for me. He was texting me being like, someone needs to keep those people in line. I vote for you. I would have voted for Simp. you. Thank I want you to know. I would have voted for you. Zoo animals. Yeah. <laughs> someone needs to keep those New York freaks in line. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm the perfect person for the job. I would have okay. absolutely voted for you. A vote against Tommy is a vote for justice. That's how nice. I feel. That's perfect. How I felt too. Well, he would have actually been a dictator. No, I know. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> yeah. This is just like a. I just feel good that people like me more than him, or 52 percent of people like me more than him. Yeah. That's all that really matters. And to that me. was close. But I look. Who do you think swung know. the vote? I don't know, but there are a lot of people that didn't vote. People that forgot. Marty, I mean Marty. Marty uh, fucking forgot. I was like, you're but right. Marty <laughs> going over to your side c- could definitely have uh, well, swung. I think that definitely that definitely helped. Or um, well, I think him going over to my side probably hurt me because if it were just if it were the three of us still, the votes would have been split between them, and then mm. I would have gotten more. Billy was right about that. Billy said some shit about like school elections, how girls always go in and the girls always win because the guy votes are split, and then the, all the girls vote for the girl. And that definitely would have happened. Well, they consolidated the guy vote. 
Exactly. So it was boy versus boys versus girls, but the girls won this time. Damn. We're on our way up. And like I, I, I did promise, as soon as Barbie comes out on uh, HBO, I'm going to play it on every screen all day long. I like that. That's a power move. The, with the bad map and open. everything? Exactly. With the bad map and everything. It's going to be <laughs> <Awesome>. great. <laughs> all right. Well, thank you, right. Kelly. Thanks for, the questions were good. I, 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 I will now worse. have, uh, I'm going to refresh. So we'll keep it running. Every Perfect. time I see you, I'll have questions for you. I look forward to that. I do miss you. I miss you as well. Our talks. I look forward to, our, uh, to my trip out west. Yes. <laughs> You should take it by horse and buggy. <laughs> oh, my God, yeah. <laughs> or a train. Wagon. <laughs> the queen's carriage. Yeah, the queen's carriage. Yeah. How are we feeling, Tim? F- belly full? No, not yet. <laughs> not a five in. I need I need pace. I need a little bit more pace. I need a couple. I need urgency. Yeah. I need urgency. There hasn't been a single belch, though. Where's it going? Yeah, I'm concerned about that. I, I did want to discuss that with you. What, can I belch? Oh, my yeah, gosh, of course. yes. By all means. You drink that can, that counts Jeez. as two. Okay. Yeah. So that'd be seven. Straight think, from the can. because Brandon the, got lost. Yeah, yeah, did he go to get ice? Oh, yeah, what the hell? Is he, he eating he's something? ordering Chick-fil-A. Check your phone. Big up. Oh, shit. Damn, God damn it. Hopefully he's not in the bathroom with my Did he get pulled in. into unnecessary roughness? Brandon flushed his balls. Oh, he's getting cornered about Pick Central. He's getting oh, cornered. hell oh, yeah. With cool. face paint on. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, yes. Awesome. <laughs> cornered. Can, can we, he didn't even come back, back with the ice. He doesn't have the, the cups. <laughs> oh, he doesn't even have the ice. The ice? Where's the ice? Yeah. Well, well, how'd that talk go? Connor Griffin's got it. I Who got you? cornered. I got cornered, yeah. About what? <laughs> I got cornered. About what? By, about the time slot for um, mostly sports. What is it? Uh, we don't know yet. That's What's a, the answer That's the thing be? that people don't even realize. Apparently, you just get cornered for time slots around this motherfucker well, now. Oh, people don't realize that when Brandon wanted to do a new show. <laughs> there we go. Oh, it is. Oh, yeah. yeah. That that's resonated. Two. That counts as two. That's seven. When Brandon wanted to new, new, uh, do, do a new show, he wanted to do the Pick Central time, so I said, no, you can't do that. That Pick Central's been going. Yeah, it was an established show. It's been running for... I stood up for the Pick Central's, guys. Yeah. He he said, I, yeah, let them have the spot. You go an hour before them. So I started making plans for 11, uh, 11 Eastern and 10 Central for three months. That's been my time slot. And then Kevin came in and moved them last week, and they took my time slot. So what's your new time slot going to be? I'm not going to change it. We're going to go to 11. Why don't you just go earlier? You're going to go against... Because I've already moved for him once. Central? Yeah, but, a, right, a, but a, who mor- a morning show. Hasn't show. Even, the show hasn't even aired yet. I moved for him once. Yeah, yeah, but people are used to it. People are used to listen to mostly sports at, yeah. at 11. And you'd have you'd have the wake-up Mincy bump whenever shouldn't, that comes Shouldn't by. you discuss this with Mark? Mark pretty much just goes with whatever. Hey. You Your commute, you should go to the office early. That doesn't make sense. Yeah, it it does. makes perfect sense. I'm not worried about my commute. My commute shouldn't be a factor you in these should worry about your commute. No, I sh- I- Rush hour will be brutal. You should be an 8 a.m. to 2.30 p.m. guy. But that that's beside the point. A, a, a month ago, or three months ago, when it was time for, when we were leaving and starting the show, they wanted to keep the time slot. Which I defended them. Fine. And, and I said, okay, that makes sense. I moved an hour. And then somebody else wanted their time slot. They they jumped out of the way and took my spot. If they want to jump out of his way. Don't take the spot. Don't take the spot that I already moved to. Got issues. You understand? I understand. Fucked. You're fucked in the head. I'm a fucked in the head. And I just also Big Evan Marty cornered me, and I was ha- trying to have a serious conversation where I was trying to act mad at him. <laughs> I was wearing this fucking face paint. So at one point I said, Big Evan, I, we can't talk if I'm wearing this. He said, I can get past it if you can. And so we just like had this tense conversation with me dressed like David. You're going against your former show. What type of wrestling shit is that? They're going against me. What did you? Where'd you leave it? I don't know. I said we'll figure it out. Why don't you do an evening show? Oh no, I can't do an evening show. I have been telling Pick Central they should go evening. The gambling show should go later. Should have always gone later. But whatever. People don't want to work. Late. People don't want to work. Late. I'll take it early. You're you're part of the problem. I would so much rather have the yak be at like 5 p.m. Yeah. It awesome. was for three I do years. Think, we did I, it at 6 p.m. I do yeah. think there's value, and uh, somebody's got to grab the early morning spot at Barstool. Cause Wake up Mincy. Somebody has to. Well, I mean, uh, yeah. And and if that's what I, if that's maybe the best thing for us, maybe. But Somewhat sports, me and Roan's new show. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Same time slot A little as bit guys. of sports. Some why sports. Mm. I don't even still understand. I do think that. Doing <coughs> two shows at the same time is dumb because I would imagine that live sh- viewers helps advertisers. I don't understand a lot of things. I don't understand why why we had to uh, rearrange the schedule in the first place. Why we couldn't have just found an empty spot for the new show. That's what I don't understand. Why do we change everything? I don't know, brother. 
is what it is. We'll figure it out. Just fucking quit then. Not that dude. big of a deal. Yeah. I don't know. I might stick with cans. Yeah. <laughs> it count as two. Where'd you find the ice? I had to go behind the bar upstairs. Okay. Behind the bar upstairs. That's the only place you can get. So you just got in a full fight with David Bowie. He <laughs> did. I did. Are you guys going to get face paint? What, what the hell's yeah. going on here? I think Rico's in there now. You didn't get face paint. You got Bob Dylan rolling like thunder, like a brother. Marshmallow. You just got rolling a, thunder. You got a light coating of white. Oh, oh. There's nothing you could confuse him. You could. It's uh, this is Bob is. Dylan rolling thunder. You like one of those ghosts from Super Mario World that move when you're not looking at them. You said Ew. you didn't want a lot of paint. You got your entire face. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a really good point. Well, this it's was just an easy primer. It's just it's was a lot an of easy. Colors. This was an easy one. I didn't want to. I don't want. I don't like sitting in there for so long, and having to be like. What's Rico getting? Do we know? Making noises out of my nose. No idea. Is he doing a musician? I'm holding my breath. Did you tell him musician. I, I, I did. Yeah. Musician. He, what, so what is he a physician? <laughs> He'll do kiss. Physician. <laughs> gonna do kiss or he's gonna? Do oh, kiss. Tim, get it out. There we go. I like it. You're at nine. Well, we're counting two, a can as two because that's what a if you pour right, it in right, glass. Right. Oh. To mimic the cheesecake factory. <laughs> yeah, go back to the glass. Cooler's wild. Colorful cooler. Beach cooler. Yeah, remember when you made that porn CD? Oh, yeah. Yeah? What about it? What did you have to... Were you? <laughs> I don't know. That was, just, at, that was an open-ended question. I guess there's no way to... No other way to phrase this. Were you looking at titties and cooch all day for work? No. Did you see any? Yeah, I saw the videos. Okay. Was it the same chick nothing, every time? Nothing Let me refresh what this is about. Well, there's... there's it, huh. it, Poker party. You designed this game. You designed this game. The interactive oh, I, strip I coded poker the game. game. Is that Kathy Willits? Yeah, she's America's Holy favorite nympho, oh, right? I remember her. Wait, you could... Oh, wait, you could play against six hey, beautiful the... opponents? Yeah, there's a back screen to this, too. I don't know if he's got the other picture. Was the intent this. to have dudes undressing at their home, playing against their computer? Uh, do I assume the want computer never won. In right? your privacy. Or just you... like you lost all the yeah. time. That was actually Naked a very good fuck. poker. Oh. You'd be surprised how difficult it. it was to uh, the beat, beat the... Beat them and get through to the end. They're geniuses. It's like how Molly's many times game. did you beat them? I just coded a special backdoor so I could get through any time. Nice. <laughs> was it hard work? Yeah, it was rock hard. Yeah, I was like, it was. A <laughs> DJ's mom is also in the booth. Yeah. Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> TJ wants to be anywhere oh, but no. here right now. <laughs> oh, TJ's right between them. When does this come out? Wednesday? Thursday. 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 Okay. Thursday. At tree thirty. At tree thirty. Damn, we got to get our hands on that game or a modern version of it DJ with some it. AI. We try. It's Andrew tried to look at it. It's like not runnable in like modern operating systems. You were able to like access the like the folders, but you couldn't actually do anything with it. So we got to buy an old. Computer. Can we pull it back up? Well, you could. Yeah, you could take apart the videos. They're on there. Wait, so you Maybe were thought about putting more words on the front. <laughs> <laughs> I coded it. I didn't design the cover. Play your cards right. You can take the shirt off their backs and then some. Where else was their shirts? Wow. Yeah. <laughs> how did this? Did you have a friend that was like, buddy, I've got a job for you? Or was it? Like, yeah, how did you stumble into it? Yeah. Uh, somebody had learned uh, about my website where I used to do some consulting work on the side to, to code different things. I used to code a lot of screensavers. I did some work for a couple of ad agencies on the side and... Uh, he you found coded screensavers? Yeah. Like the Which, stars that came at you? Yeah. yeah. Stuff is this like the that. only uh, Naked Woman game you ever coded? This is the only Naked Woman game I've ever, ever coded. Any famous screensavers? Do we know your work? No. You didn't do the pipes? You didn't know the pipes guy? Did you ever meet the no. pipes guy? No, I'd never met the pipes guy. That was what crazy. The, <laughs> the way they changed colors? <laughs> yeah. That's a hitchings. What are the most famous? Uh, <laughs> the maze. Microsoft. The Microsoft Earth. Earth. <laughs> yeah. uh, the, oh, yeah. <laughs> the mountains <laughs> one. Right. Mountains. Yeah. Oh yeah, the pipes. Man. What what about the fly? Fly? You remember the flying toasters? Oh, right. Yes, flying, the flying toasters. toasters. Was the pipes guy the goat? Is he the goat? I mean, look it's at that. Dan Flash's shirt not. now. Yeah. <gasps> Sorry. <laughs> Gotta go somewhere. When are you guys getting your faces painted? <laughs> Nico's in there now. <laughs> You're so to, nervous. I'm so about it's to, not for another three hours. Oh, it's such a long wait. I'm not getting my face painted. No, you're not. Thank you. Uh, you could if you wanted could. to. Could if you wanted She's to. She's here. Uh, 
I wouldn't mind if you went before me, just so I don't have to sit in the face paint all day. Paint you up like a root beer. He How? is hoping that the wet wheel. I just done this myself. Oh yeah, you want to spin the wheel? Hey, what if the wet wheel hits? Been very he's actively hoping done? for a wet. No, no, no. But oh, we could we we could spin the wheel whenever we want. Drinking. Yeah, we could spin whenever we want. Only had nine. Then you got to get repainted. Or you could put a plastic bag over your head. I'll allow it. Well, I'll do. Sweet child. Is that Dylan? There he goes. He's drinking. Some Where do we go now? Face paint is Bob Dylan. Come back singing Guns N' Roses. I've had Guns N' Roses stuck in my head all day. Why are you guys feuding so hard today? We're not feuding. You are feuding hard. I can't Brandon's wait until this case race. Ass. You are feuding hard. Brandon drinks zero drinks, and you put Brandon's the team on, on your my back. Fucking dick right They're going to implode, yeah. Big Cat. They're going to be That was the other show. Hop off, bro. Totally different show. Hop off. You guys can't stop beefing with each other. Why don't you guys settle it out with a nice ball tangle and fucking <laughs> whoever can pull away from the other fastest. It's going to look like when those rats get tangled up in the ground. <laughs> yeah. Sprinting away from each other. And just their balls. <laughs> in like 7,000 years, they'll find their skeletons tangled with each other like two bi- or two deers who hooked so antlers. Beautiful. Yeah, the deers hooked antlers. We talked about king antlers. rats before. Uh. It's when rats get tangled up by their tails and they just die in this huge ball of rat. Is that a real thing? Yeah. That's what, deer That's what happens like to that. deers all the time. But it's, I think it's going to happen to your... Your testicles. Your balls. Your balls. Your testicles. As there, I mean, there are some long balls. There has to have been balls that got tangled before. Yeah. My, my friend's balls got tangled. Takes two to Just tangle. his own balls. His own balls. His own? Yeah, his torsion. Buddy. It's one of my biggest fears. Oh, yeah. yeah. Sitting oh, in a hot bath. Worst pain he's ever, yeah. And then it, he said the, re- the, the release from it was like the greatest feeling he's ever had. So he's he addicted doing, like, to it now. Was he doing like a or something? Like what was he doing? Oh, no, he was just like walking and it, they got tangled up. Sleeping and then naked a, can happen. Yeah. You t- if you're what? having a... a Night terror. You're having a long awesome. ball day. Oh. Yeah. And he yeah, and he sat in his bathtub and then they just If you sleep naked, you're relief. shitting your your sheets. Yeah. People people fart every night when they're asleep, no matter who you are, so no matter your gender, marks. and That's you are pooping your sheets. Nudist colonies, that I'm like you're all sitting on each other's poop a little bit. Yeah. I could never I've tried. I never could never takes. <laughs> <Being naked? laughs> yeah. I hate it. Wake up I fully hate clothed. It. Yep. <laughs> I wake, Not up, even. I wake up with a Canada goose jacket on. <laughs> Sewn into, mummified. Yeah. <laughs> Sewn into a sleeping bag. Yeah, you boys have to tangle your balls. Takes two to tangle. Losers tangle. Put it on the wheel. Tangle your balls. Tangle balls. Man, people have to be tangle. massively disappointed that Sass doesn't have a nice tight sack. Oh, yeah. People gotta be so pissed What's off. the point of youth if you have long balls? <laughs> Ask myself that every day. When you hit thirty, it's go- it's going to be dragging going to be down to my you. knees. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. God. Why, God? <laughs> Is there an operation for that? I'm Ooh, sure. Got to be. Got to be. Some sort yeah. of re- testicular rejuvenation. Yeah. Ball, ball tightening. <laughs> I want child balls, Doc. <laughs> Give him balls. Yeah. There's that guy who got like a liter of his son's blood to get his balls tighter. Did you guys see that story? Yeah, that famous uh, dude, right? That super famous guy who's, yeah. who's like 45 and thinks he looks 18, but he just looks 45. He's just been pumping his blood in to just get his... like a bad 45. Yeah, just like, a, like a scary 45. <laughs> who is this? Can we see him? This guy who is uh, just like transplant, transfusing, whatever, taking his son's blood. That was 11. Let's go. He looks like what I look like right now. He looks like my face. He looks pla- <laughs> like a melted wax figure, looks kind of. looks fucking crazy. Like yeah. slick back hair, like, but it's like a 90s idea of what a surfer is. He's like point break style hair. Being like, I'm actually young now because I took my son's blood. Yeah, he like gelled up his hair. That was the uh, proof <laughs> yeah. that he was young. He's a puka younger. shell ne- <laughs> necklace on. He I'm actually a child his... now. After drinking my son's semen. There's a tech CEO that did the same thing. This is, I think, this is the, who I'm talking about, or no, maybe a different guy. These guys are just spinning. Despite it not working. <laughs> That's awesome. It's like when X tried to shoot off that rocket and it fucking failed. And they're like, no, it was supposed to fail. Yeah. Perfect, perfect launch. Yeah. I also think of myself as a teen. And if my dad was like, hey, I need your plasma, I'd be like, ew, no. He does look what? young. What does he look no, like? No, he doesn't. He looks, looks like a, a like robot. action figure. Yeah. I would say, in the middle? I would say that guy's like 55. He looks like the dad. <laughs> yeah, he looks right. older than he like, is. He looks old as fuck to me. Hey, what? He does have a necklace. Ugh. I feel like he looks pretty young. You, you Who's the guy on the left? Impressive neck right here. Is that? I wish I had. That's that like neck. what he would, I guess, look like. Huh. He's like anything to not look like that guy. I want to be like that my young photoshopped boy. Photoshopped in. Huh. Tiny ass family. Young plasma. Are y'all not getting your face painted? 
Why? Oh, I, I, I guess I'm after. I uh, I'm supposed more? to be at 420. <laughs> Rico's it now? doing nine the, minutes. Rico's doing the Sistine Chapel on his face. <laughs> <laughs> Why is Rico pinned in there for fucking hours? I know Connor he's said doing, he's complaining. Though. He's doing Gautier. Rico's hey, complaining. Rico's the guy complaining? said artist, and he's yeah. doing somebody that I used to know. <laughs> it looks pretty sweet with the glasses. Does it? Are you doing young, regular, or old? <laughs> that regular. looks awesome. Oh. Regular? I'll do young. I'll try to do baby. Well, will she be able to do that? I, I don't like know. That's like way out of. <laughs> I got a cool I, I, mind. Just go three. What's the report, Connor? Rico's done. So whoever wants to. What, what did Rico get? get? No. Yeah, see, why not? See him. He, he got a. Uh, he got Post Malone. Oh. 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 That's How did that take Tattoos. He's going to have to do the tats. <laughs> Nick, you want to go? Yeah, yeah, I think you're next up. What are you going to do, Nick? Insane clown posse. Oh yeah. Yeah. Let's go, Nick. ICP. Yeah. I went when they marched on Washington D.C. against the FBI. I went down for that, and it's a, it's an interesting group. Wait. Juggalos? Oh, the yeah. Juggalos? Yeah, they what marched they on D.C. For? The FBI cons- labeled them a, not a terrorist group, but a gang, like an official gang. And so they went to protest being labeled a gang. They should that label can hurt Swifties their as a gang. Jobs. It was like a gang thing to do is go down there all yeah. together. And You'd be like, we're not a gang. We're just going to get everyone together and march on Washington. Yeah. Yeah. Like the Million Man March, that fucking gang. Bastards. It's great. Anytime a helicopter flew over, which there's just helicopters all over DC, they thought it was the FBI like watching them and they would flip off all the helicopters oh, like and like, Goodfellas. yeah, they were. Yeah. Oh shit, you've seen Goodfellas? Good. I have. I love Lenny <laughs> so much. Hey. I fucking love that movie. What? No way. It's God. my favorite movie. It's a deep cut. Uh, I think it just finished 12. <clears throat> yep. How do you think this is going, Tim? <laughs> I'm fine. Okay. It's not like I'm drunk. Would you How like do you think this is going, TJ? I'm just happy he's happy. Ev! What was it? We don't have to get into the details, but what was it like having an argument with David Bowie? Uh, <laughs> I mean, I won. I told him, I told him, I said, I can look past it, but I was just laughing the whole time. Yeah. It's tough. Yeah, he, well, he didn't want to. I didn't want to. I said we we gotta have this conversation later when I'm not dressed like. Good that. on you to corner him while he's weak. Yeah, yeah I was like, no, no, I can look past. It's it. also two of y'all. It was two of us. It's true. You two. You're David two. Bowie. I I try I, I try, but they they came and. You're Brandon Walker, David Bowie, and Ziggy Stardust. So that's three on one. I don't on know how our kitchen is oriented right there, where we got the 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 table and then the fridge, and then there's an empty space. I was in the space, and they cor- I couldn't get out. That was smart. We, we did corner him. That's kind of true. I like that. All right, that's all. Just, I've always wondered what it's like to get in a fight with David Bowie. It's a dream. Uh, Who did David Bowie fight? Did he have public beef with anyone? Well, he had beef. Well, not publicly. Mm. Uh, who? Was, what movie was he in? He was in one of those fucking magician the movies. Mm. The Labyrinth. Oh, the Labyrinth. Spin in the balls. Was always under pressure. But he played Tesla in uh, the Prestige or the other one. One of you those. Need to watch the Prestige. Movies. Fucking fire. I've got people in my life that say the pre- Prestige is their favorite movie, and yeah, I've Aaron never Rod. seen it. It's supposed to be phenomenal. Why is everyone saying it's supposed to be like a no? No it's one's like watched a it. Nine out of ten. I've never, never even it. heard of it. I always want to watch it when I go home, and my mom never wants to watch it. She doesn't like <laughs> magic movies. <You> can't, <laughs> <not another laughs> wait, wait. So when you go home, you walk in the door, you're like, "Mom, I want to <laughs> no, watch we this always, magic we movie." We always watch movies, and I and I'm like, "Let's watch the Prestige. It looks great." She's like, "Nah." He's like, "I don't want to watch the Prestige." <laughs> <laughs> Always want to watch it's not it. About home. Magic, you live right? in the city alone, where Whole you can watch it whenever magic. you want. The world of it. It's not like you know. It's about like the perfect trick, isn't it? Oh, well, I gotta watch it. So don't ruin it. That's the third part. The Prestige. DJ, are you proud of your dad right now? Hey, bro's crushing it. He really <laughs> is. It's Putting you're making it, it seem super easy. I haven't thrown up yet, though. I mean, yeah. the are you struggling at all at this point, or you're? No. How did you know it was totally 20 fine. on the initial date? It's very difficult talking to you and not thinking of the beeve right now. So, hey. awesome. Right for the best. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's my favorite look. If you ever, you saw Pat when he looked like that for a yeah. while. Oh, yeah. It's just. And for no reason. There was no reason behind it. Well, he it was, looked cool. That was I thought reason. it had to do with what he was doing in production at the time. I, it worked on me. Yeah. yeah. I'm, look, I'm liking myself right now. <laughs> yes. Hello. What's up? All I need is a Coke now. We're all set. Yeah, how did you know it was 20 on the dot? Good question, Ron. I guess. Okay. 
Could be more, could be less. We'll never oh. know. Oh. Well, as long as it's 20 today, then it's corroborated. Well, the entire premise of this show is it was based on it being 20. Though. Well, he's got to get 20. That's not what uh, he started out with. He, he went straight to 30 as soon as the story was over. Well, that's Big Cat. He's always going to go 10 more. I know. Yeah, it's called the 10X mentality. You Doc- <laughs> know that. Just Dr. Evil every time you he comes up with know that, dude. You escalate, you escalate, you escalate, you escalate. Grant Cardone. Is he still, is that still? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Stronger yeah. than ever. Okay. Oh, yeah. Is it? Yeah. People base their life around it. Yeah, I love like the. He's making his kid does the face of it now because yeah. he's got that kid poised. I, I saw him bragging the other day that his kid's going to enter college a millionaire. Yeah. Is that here or maybe mm. somewhere else? Maybe that was on TikTok. But is that even a brag? <laughs> <laughs> it's like, wouldn't. You said I could burn. If he's entering college a millionaire, why is he going to college? But also, isn't is that not a. That's not a brag. Your dad's a millionaire. Yeah. Right. Or if he just puts money in the trust fund for him, I guess. But uh, right. Yeah, he, I guess he's just going to fuck. How does a trust fund work? Do you get the money oh, like instantly? Oh, or you, you have to get a certain age. age. Oh, okay. You'll get some when you're 25, some when you're 30, I think. Yeah. I, I got to decide about my four kids how I'm going to divvy up the money because they're not getting 25% each because I do like some better. Right. I just got to decide who's getting what's the smallest percentage. Is it only going to your kids? What about some to the program? What program? No, I, state. I, I, just, I think it'll all be my kids, maybe my wife. Mm. What about uh, your sister? I just, I just ruined her car for her. What else you want me to do for her? I would definitely give twenty five percent to the program. Yeah, me too. So the true. You want me to give twenty five percent of my fortune to the yak? No, no yeah. t- I'm talking state, about the state. Brother. State. state. Oh, and I oh I am already given that. What would you like named already, after I'm you a, there? If you could have anything named after you there. I think money to a college that you didn't go to is fucking insane. <laughs> <laughs> I really? I'm, so crazy. People uh, probably do it at Notre Dame. Crazy. I'm trying to get players, buddy. I'm trying to get players. It's crazy. I'm trying to get players. You should start scouting. You just need one man's ale. Oh, I already, change, they would change the program wait, forever. Wait, we're already. Well, who do you got? Who, who who's are your top high school players we're, right yeah, now? Yeah, who's the pipeline? We're, we're good. We're, we're fine. Hmm. Things are good. Any, any guys coming out of Mass? We don't usually recruit a lot of guys coming out of Massachusetts. What about usually Pennsylvania? South? Pennsylvania's a hotbed. Yeah, we, we really I'll stay. get you some of these St. Joe prep boys. We stay mostly in the southeast. You talk to some of these St. Joe prep boys, those are dogs over there. Smart players, too. You get some dogs? Come on. Need some dogs. We need some dogs. Marvin Harrison Jr. is a St. Joe's prep boy. Come on, man. That means the quarterback? Jeremiah Trotter Jr. is a – Does that mean the quarterback for Ohio State this year? McCord is, yes. He's a St. Joe prep guy. He was in Neighborhood Eats. I don't think he's going to win that job. He already won it. Who, oh, Kyle McCord? Yeah. When did they say that? I think Wednesday. Devin, I think Devin Brown's got that. Nah. He already got that. Mm. He already got that. That's another one for for Papa Hitch. He's crushing yeah. it. Yeah. Putting in work. Sending Connor on an ice, ice run. Smart. Smart oh, man. Let's work today. Fill it's it the up. top recruits right now. Please. Uh, recruits by the way, Mississippi State. Let's get some guys in there. Hi, at number four, Andrew Rap <laughs> <laughs> He's uh, coming out of Milton, Mass. Oh, good for him. Yeah, but he's going to Penn State. What sport? Football. He's number four. He's the fourth biggest recruit in the nation. Yes, yeah. he's going to state. What, what, My state. What position is he playing? I don't have to give any money for that to happen. Uh, let's see. Sounds like a tackle. Kicker. Tight end. Ooh. Rap player. He's a white boy. <laughs> <laughs> baby Gronk? I'm going to go ahead and say the number four recruit in the country is not a white tight end from Massachusetts. 6'4", 240. Or 6'5", 240. East. Now this says he's 6'4", 253. Well, why do you keep not a Milton Mass. Well, numbers. What? I don't know. They, they changed it up. Let's see. Number one is Samson Okunlola. Oh, he's from. Oh my God, they're all from Mass. So look at him. <laughs> oh, yeah, I look am at looking at Mass. At mass. <laughs> <laughs> they're all from Mass. Oh shit! What the hell? Oh my God, they're all from Mass. All the best college That's football players great. in the country are all coming. Resort. Resort. They're all from Brockton and Rockland. Resort to uh, country Malcolm or the whole country. Freaking Malcolm Lola again, dude. That guy's going to be a beast. All right, let's see all state. Arch Manning. Thank you. That's, la- that's last year. The number one this year is a, is a defensive lineman from Missouri. Any mass boys in the top ten? No. Oh, I guess oh. Riolas. This is oh, Riola, yeah. Dominic Riola, son? Yeah. yeah. 
Holy shit. And that makes me feel old. There's the defensive tackle. And he's yeah, not Samson. going. Where's Rayola going? Georgia. Yeah. The, he already, the fact that he's not going to Nebraska. He already transferred to uh, to Georgia to play high school. Was Rayola a 6'1 tackle? Wasn't he a he center? He was a center. Okay, I'm thinking of someone else. His there brother went to Wisconsin. The Chargers, that was a 6'1 tackle. It didn't make any fucking sense to he me. He was a wild boy, too. Rayola? Yeah. The son is very viral on TikTok because he trains with uh, Mahomes' QB coach. So everybody's like prophesizing him. Where's Baby Diggs? I think he's twenty twenty seven. Wait, so all of these guys are from <laughs> Massachusetts? <laughs> Baby I Diggs. Know. I haven't what seen a mass fuck? yet. Twenty twenty six. Idaho. Aaron Noland. That's a good name. Yeah, he's uh, going to Ohio State. Huh. He's in Connecticut. Wait, so the number four in the country isn't a white tight end from? <laughs> <laughs> no mass. Uh, by the way, high noon. High noon. If you're a tequila lover who's never satisfied with uh, malt hard seltzer offerings, you're going to love the new high noon tequila seltzer, premium hard seltzer made with real tequila and real juice, clean finish because it's made with real Blanco tequila, only 100 calories, gluten-free and no added sugar available in four bright, crisp flavors, strawberry, lime, grapefruit, and passion fruit. Look for them on Drizzly, your local convenience or liquor store. Go visit highnoonspirits.com to find it near you today. High noon, the drink of the summer. We love our high noon. Go get high noon today. Uh, the most delicious drink out there. Rome, what do you th- what do you think about um, Messiah Minkins? Oh, he's about to be a beast. Yeah. Yeah. Is it Minkins? Yeah. Yeah, he's going to be a legend. Yeah, where's he? Six class, twenty twenty six. He's already committed. Was he play? Was he play? What position? Football. Back. Another one for Mr. Hitching. Running back, but he's a small guy, five ten, two hundred. I don't know if he's going to make that it. Is the quintessential size for a running back. You just worry, you know, that five ten. That's exactly – 5'10", 200 is what you want a running back to be. I think 200 is a little bit light in the ass. 5'10", 205, 210? 210. I'd want 5'11", 240. A little big. He's not that's Mike not, Allstock. Not he got that speed, though. No, I mean, 5'11", 240 is not going to have that speed. 240, 240 with 40 speed? is straight muscle? Come Mike on, Tolbert. Brother. Use your brain. Mm. Who's the heaviest pro there ever was? Like the There's been, there ever been like uh, the guy in the Eagles. Right? Jordan Davis is massive. Not well, uh, my no Myelata. He's massive too. There's a hilarious uh, freshman this year who's like four four sixty. Yeah, four sixty yeah. for who? Yeah, uh, I don't know who he plays. See you no. Tight tight team. body forward. De- definitely has a tight body, right? Might be Tech. Might be Tech. Hell Might be Tech. Yes. But it's, it's a guy that's like four six, like five five eleven or six one, four six. There he is. Oh shit. What what team does he play for? Big Bubba. This might not be him. Brandon, you guys it's aren't Big getting Bubba. anyone. It's Big Bubba. State. Yes, we are. Just relax. looking right now. Everyone's going to Georgia, Ohio State. Yep. Right. That's where Arizona. players go. Arizona. Off to see. Arizona's working. You see you. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. And all the replies were like, A and M. Can't wait till our strength and conditioning coach gets his hands on him. Alabama. Brandon, you guys aren't getting shit. I'm in like the top 40s for. Yeah, we don't start in the 40s. We start in like one, the the the, the Ole Miss is getting the top 30. No, that's gotta hurt. He's not really going to Ole Miss, but uh, he's not going to Ole Miss. Huh? Hey, did you have any retraction from the two east uh, retraction? Oh, 100 percent. No, that I think they're lying. I don't believe a word they say. And the fact, mm, you know what? Never mind. Mm-hmm. What? Matt, we, 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 having, everyone's having going to Ole Miss. On here was crazy. All the Mississippi what? guys are going to Ole Miss. No, they're not. They're all. It's like everyone. Can you stop? I don't. I don't want to get mad about recruiting on here. Oh, you are all going you're to Georgia mad. and Ole Miss. Are you you're donating enough money? No. You got to start. Do- you got to up that to forty. Just started getting the money. You gotta why did you? Say, why more. did you get this freaking house, Brandon? This what? is last year. Huh? The you don't care about you? your team, Brandon. Brandon, I'm in the top 100 recruits coming. Oh, here we go. 97. Oh. All right, you guys got Jimothy Lewis. 97. Jimothy. Jimothy. That's his name, Jimothy. <laughs> What what we're doing here? The laughing stock. Just looking at some recruits. AJ Harrell, that's my that? guy. That's, that's the best player in Mississippi. Wait, what year are you guys looking at though? Because I'm looking at I think I'm, I'm at 24 at right now. And <laughs> okay, they're at 33rd in the country. They have five this four is stars. Hilarious. Just to piss off Brandon. Where's Wisconsin at? Oh, I'm not seeing yeah. a lot of Wisconsin. Oh, Wisconsin 23rd. Oh, okay. We we're more of a. I'm looking at top recruits coming out of Mississippi. We don't finish. That's not how recruiting works. We we don't finish top. 25 in recruiting. That's not how it works. I would just want. I would want to be Penn picking State's up some none. boys who care about the, care about this town. You know, care about West Point. What ta- well, West Point is not where Mississippi State is. I just want. A, I just want a group of guys that are local. Point City. Care about this rivalry. They care they about this. Salt of the earth guys. Now I don't want to. 
the school. I, I, I'm working on it. We have a four star from West Point who is committed to Florida right now, and I got to. What? I mean, Florida has the number three on. class. I got to fix that. How could you let that happen? I, I, How are you working on it? I, the word, word, Stephen Shea. Who are you waving at? Stephen Shea. No. But, oh. You brought me ice. Right. Well, I think that's for the case. Right now. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think. <laughs> Came in with like five. Slow your roll there, Tim. You just went from loser to winner. Let's relax. <laughs> Who's number one? Who's got the first pick? First pick. <laughs> can we? Can we? Just... I can't talk football like recruiting. This. He's talking number four recruiting. Class, you should be. You should start a college football podcast. <laughs> <Yes>. Recruiting. <laughs> Where you just read off your phone the whole time. Conan Daniels? Is that who you're talking about? Uh, or it's Kanan. Kanan? Yeah. K-A-H-N-E-N. Kanan Daniels. Oh, running back, 5'11", 190. Mm-hmm. So that's Sass. That's the height Sass wants, but 50 pounds light. Wow. Tenth in the state. Uh, Julian Lewis. Why don't we see if we can get him over to fucking... Uh, I don't know who Julian Lewis the QB is. Oh, he he's should. A the QB. It's probably part of the problem. He's a hell of a beast. You don't know these guys. He's 6'1", he's six, he's six, one, 185. Perfect size for a QB. He's a four-star. Plays like a five-star. So small. Yeah, but his game says five-star. He's a six, freshman three, two, in college right, or high school right now. Wait, what are we doing? So your team that you're so crazy about is not even like... It's not even like a big team. It's not even... You know what? You can't help where you're from or who you love. Okay. And I love who I love. Isn't that right, Hitchings? Hell yeah, brother. Not you. <laughs> love is love. You didn't want to weigh in, Tim? No. Okay, cool. Are you hitting a wall or are you still? You just we really got to be focused on right <coughs> now. Oof. How are you getting home? Oh, we can get him to state. I'm not worried about you being drunk or anything, but you're going to need to pee multiple times. He hasn't peed once yet. I know. Impressive. You're, oh, you're really fixated on it. I am. Well, I, I never get in a car or a train or a plane without knowing exactly when and where I can pee next. Well, you're old. Mm -hmm. Tim, you're at least three years older than me. How old are you, Tim? He seems younger. 66. Wow. You're a beast. At least three years older than you're me. A beast. <laughs> are you retired? No. I'm 44. I could be your son. Do you have to take work off today? I have to pay TJ's college bills how could i ever retire Rutgers makes you, you charge pay? for Rutgers. Oh, yeah out the ass what wait did you have to take rock. today off work of course drink root beer that's awesome <laughs> he went to college and ended up the producer of the yeah are you proud of tj very proud of tj yeah. Oh, yeah. are you too proud how could you be too proud you have kids yeah no they're not, i'm not that proud of them yeah well, you will you jobs. will be if you, you do it right they gotta earn that. I mean, they are all millionaires. <laughs> <laughs> is there anybody at this company that you think has affected TJ's life the most positively and got him out of game time hell and created a career? Oh, for Mark him? Titus has. Yeah, Mark Titus. I feel mm -hmm. like anybody here that you need to personally thank? I think Big Cat. Yep, mm -hmm. that's the right answer. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Tim. You got to uh, go with a millionaire. But you got to understand that that you know Not the guy who can't even support his local uh, <laughs> football team. <laughs> he he didn't get a recruit. If he hadn't uh, land a recruit, yeah, or a he, couple steps first. He almost ended up in Mississippi because of you. Yeah, I wasn't. Wow. Wow. That, that was true. Wow. That would have been a great life for him. It would have been a great what? life. Not no. for me and my. He found wife. a nice southern girl. He would have made you some grandkids, and it would have been a happy life. What? I really think if we can get Bryce Underwood to state, <laughs> <laughs> it could change all of our lives. Or Bryce Underwood, Monte Waller from uh, he's from Picayune, Mississippi. Well, Picayune's way down the coast. But uh, it's still, he's going to Florida. Why? Why not keep him in state? It's NIL, he's man. It's NIL. Local. Why is he not staying local? Get him well, local. Of all, it's Picayune. You gotta. You gotta. You, I think. I think you're investing in the wrong thing. I love how this is going. Picayune. I don't think you should be <laughs> investing in the program. I think you should be investing in what's around the program. Picayune's four give hours the kids, away. Give the kids a reason to be in Mississippi. Water yeah. slides. You gotta, nice you, we got to put a wall around Mississippi. Exactly. Keep them all here. Maybe get a Six Flags in there or some shit. Something, yes. that, something that the kids How are going to want to be for. Why would that help uh, get an 18 year old recruit? They're going to be like, oh shit, there's a Six Flags in Mississippi State. Right by campus. You're Mississippi telling me State. if I bought the land and put a Six Flags near Starkville, that would help? Right 100%. there. If it was right uh, there. Without a doubt, it would help. Six Flags over Mississippi. Are you saying that it wouldn't help? I mean, it can't hurt. Team right. gets free passes. I would be very interested. He gets interested. free passes, free drinks. Yeah. Gotta let the kids party. Free, yeah, free Coca-Colas. Free root beers. Free root beers. Free high noons. Nobody you want to thank personally, Tim, as we sit here? Titus. I mean, Titus. Not on the air. No. no. I think the Manziel documentary should be a, a lesson. You gotta let the kids party. That was tough with Dave getting 
uh, picture. Yeah, I know. Where he's like, I was going to party so hard that I was going to shoot myself. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just, I mean, Dave, and they're like, yo. Uh, <laughs> Dave gave him a job. That's true. Dave, would, Dave was taking a picture with Johnny Manziel, and Johnny Manziel was actively planning his suicide. <laughs> I don't want to be here. <laughs> that was the moment that. <laughs> Within 30 minutes, he had the barrel of a gun in his oh. mouth. <laughs> the only person that could save him was his best friend that he scammed people out of autographs with. Oh, poor Uncle Nate. <laughs> oh, man. I liked God. Uncle Nate being like, we had a saying at Texas a and win or lose, we still booze. Oh, yeah. That was, that was a real Glenny Balls Goodfellas moment. Yeah. <laughs> You, you believe in win or lose still oh, boost too? How does Johnny look older than Dave there? That's not, is that the picture that they used in the No, film? it was wow. it was much more it's much more alcohol. It's much involved. more Johnny Dead yeah. Eyes like yeah. I want I'm gonna kill myself too. Yeah. Oof. I liked it, but it did really kind of gloss over like the important part. That he when was he battling beat the shit out of oh. No, I was gonna say when he's battling like depression, suicidal thoughts, like they kinda like sped past it. Yeah, it did. Yeah, yeah, it kind of came to an end quick. I think it could have used this. I think it could have been two episodes easily. Yeah. I didn't watch it. I'm saving it for back to back with the Swamp documentary. It's really good. Why would you save that? I want to watch the Swamp documentary. I want to go bang bang. They're What's not, the Swamp? But you. Swamp oh, football. is that the new football documentary? Oh, yeah, Florida, Florida yeah, football, Florida. which is going to be better. They had Riley Cooper. Riley Cooper was the team leader. Well, Aaron Hernandez was the team leader. Oh, I know, but that was like Riley Cooper was like the, the vocal leader. Citizen. Yeah. Yeah. You could speak to go pee? both sides. Oh, he's not peeing. The look of the man is built. Gotta pee. I could use some more ice. Well, Connor Griffin's over there sticking around. 17, 17 up on the official scorecard and counted cans we're Oof. looking at. 10. 10 cans. Which makes sense. <laughs> I think that's about right. Because when you drink it at a restaurant, it's not a full 12 ounces. Connor, can I throw a crazy idea at you? Even when you get a. Take that bucket. What? Fill it up with ice, and then you've got ice in here. I bet you could. I bet you could put back like forty on a plane. Yeah, they give small you small ones. Splash. They give you a splash. I rode a the... small plane here yesterday, like a small plane. TRJ nine hundred. You're Probably. flying out of from Milwaukee. It was, a, but but was it a Delta Connection? I couldn't. It was Delta Connection. Yes, TRJ nine hundred. Not fit in the bathroom, and I had to pee tremendously. I went and tried once, and just. People saw me trying to get in there, and I couldn't, and I went and sat back down. Then I realized I had to pee so bad. Oh. Oh. Soul. That oh. one was big. That scared the <laughs> shit out of me. <laughs> well, ultimately, I went back in there, and I, I folded myself in and peed. Have you ever not fit in a plane bathroom? Yeah. This Sounds sad. like you did fit, though. Not really. It it My no, it abs sucks. are still cramping because so, I had to bend over. They don't build those things for guys our size. Especially those CRJs. They're not. The CRJ is actually a much more glamorous plane than people assume when you're getting on, <laughs> because you have the seats are way bigger because it's only two seats. These per aren't row. that bad, uh, but the overhead is like no space at all. Yeah, and then the bathroom. It's also, a- every time you're on one of those planes, you're usually on, only on it for like an hour. Yeah. Do you see that guy? I guess he's like a viral streamer or something like that who took oh, a Nick. Boeing 747 <laughs> by himself. <laughs> <laughs> are magnets real? Wait, you talking about Neymar? Oh yeah, so. yeah, yeah, yeah. He's a, he's a, he's not a streamer. He's a, he's a soccer star. The Saudi oh, soccer star. Okay. <laughs> Saudi <laughs> Prince sent him uh, like a, a yeah, double decker seven forty seven. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I did a show. <laughs> Hold on, that looks awesome. That looks great. It's very crisp. I did a show at the stand. It was awesome. And there was some <laughs> sort of princess in the back, and they came in with like a shit ton of security and stuff and the, and then we they were like you're not allowed to like look at them or talk to them while you're on stage <laughs> try to crowd work her oh, it was like a forbidden what did like, your dad do yeah <laughs> it was like a like as soon as i walked in they were like no talking to the people in the back right hmm. that crazy i'm I, surprised i will now be going the bathroom oh hell yeah right, i came back just fun. in time <laughs> nick that looks crazy i feel like she might have used a different I'm shade impressed. of white on you than me yours is yeah Almost yeah <laughs> she really watered you down are you, you taking your bag is. with you he poops in his bag. <laughs> <laughs> he carries around poop. Am I next, or is uh, Stephen Che going right now? Give me a can. He's huh? off, off brand. Is Che? How many has he had? Like seventeen. He had seventeen. <laughs> Jesus your, Christ. He's had ten cans. I can't see anything. Cans. 
feel like that was kind of guaranteed to happen. That was. Why do you that was. Leave that for him to open, or just do that for a couple of cans. No, don't do back that. <laughs> yes, don't do that. Why not? He's moments away from achieving a massive DJ, goal. DJ, I know it's your dad, but you agree we should definitely do that for a couple of these cans, right? Yeah, shenanigans are on the table here. Yeah. Nikki smokes prank. There's Che. Hey, Che. Okay. He's busy man. Right now? I don't know. He seems like he's like doing manual labor today. He's, like, he's in moving mode. His shoulders are slumped. Oh, he's oh, going upstairs. Running. He's going upstairs to yell at someone. Hey, I just <laughs> met you. You guys are such assholes. <laughs> Don't. <laughs> Not. Don't. <laughs> I gotta take a fucking <laughs> shit. <laughs> I'm, I'm, fine. I'm, gonna, I'm gonna snitch. Don't you fucking snitch, bitch. I'm gonna snitch. You are a snitch. Went to the bathroom. You looking for the ice man? Yeah, he's in the bathroom. Just throw that in there. Top him off. Oh. And your bare ass hands on his eyes? I have clean hands. <laughs> what do you think's happening in restaurants, dude? They're Sass standing their up. Pants. Sass, why are you standing up? He's got a dump. Hey, who's going to go tell him going next? Bathroom. Are you going wrong or am I? You're going to go I, tell him in the bathroom? I can go. I can go. I thought Stephen Che just went, but he just oh, went. Oh, Stephen Che went. Oh, okay. Che's upstairs. But no, he's coming right down now. Stephen, are you going? Are you getting your Are you going or should I? Does Che know the music? I'm going to take a piss, too. Uh, can you read the mattress for a man? You should know. Can you read the mattress for a man? Of course I can read the mattress for a man. Nobody reads about mattress firm better than me. You're the best at it. My God, I love mattress firm. Yes. Everyone needs quality sleep to feel restored and to function at their best. To achieve this, you know how you do it, Roan? How? I have the right mattress. Yep. The right mattress matters. Luckily, mattress firm is here to help. Their sleep experts receive over 200 hours of sleep training. How does that work? Two hundred hours of sleep training. They, it's an intensive mattress firm process that they, uh, yeah. that they. It's, I mean, everybody gets it, but it's fun and informative. Yeah, train them helps helps you helps match you with the right mattress and bedding accessories for your needs. With their low price guarantee, you can be confident that you'll find your perfect mattress at the best price. And if you're not totally satisfied after one hundred and twenty nights, they'll pair you with a new one. Visit a store near you or go to mattressfirm.com. The right mattress matters. Mattress firm. We'll find yours. Mattress Hell of a tag, mattress. like the kind that you don't rip off of a mattress. Oh, True. don't ever rip them off. It's illegal. It's illegal. You go, to, you go to jail for that. Jails are overcrowded with people who ripped off mattress tags. <laughs> That's what my dad first went in for. <laughs> uh, no, he was using the tag to roll. Uh, yes. Uh, yep. Uh, drugs. Meth cigarettes. To roll drugs. Yeah. Uh, okay, I'm gonna go get my face painted. Okay. Well, we're almost down. Then. Just, yeah, everybody well, gonna leave? I mean, Stephen Che is giving me uh, military hand signals to go do it. Yeah, he, he and he has our phone numbers. Yeah. Drives me nuts. He did this for me uh, when I was uh, last set Friday for Wheel. Yeah. Mm. What, what did that mean? Wheel. wheel. Oh, I see. This. Or text. I kind of like this for Wheel. He always does this one, too. What does that mean? That's the ad. Let's read That's the ad. ad. Oh, ad. Hey, big cat. Hey, guys. Ron left to get his face painted. Sass went to the bathroom. Oh, was there an the outfit shit. change? Yeah, did you change outfits? Hey, a bit of what outfit the fuck? Change? What is that? I got tired of the other shirt. That's fair. That makes yeah. sense. That's fair why enough. he took the bag in there. Hmm. You, yeah, you don't have to be dirty or sweaty to change shirts. Yeah, just get tired Your of it. Your face paint looks awesome. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, it's... I feel it's the coolest I've ever looked. Yeah. yeah. What are you going to do driving home? Are you going to have to take stops? My wife drives. Right. Uh, everywhere? Uh. Yeah. How come y'all shit on me? shotgun everywhere? She doesn't like my driving. Can you I can say the L word. I can say, say the L word. I've been married 17 years. I've sat in a car my <laughs> wife drove one time in Maybe 17 Maybe not years. even. He's, you're in a progressive relationship. Plus, you've had a lot of root beers. Don't want a mug shot. How can you say <laughs> 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 TJ, what do you think about this? When you were a kid, your mom was driving? Um, he's a lot more patient than she is. Oh! So it's, so you do drive like a bitch. It, it's e No, it's either <laughs> <laughs> he drives. Oh, I see, I see. About the he driving. doesn't want her yelling at him when he's driving. Right, yeah. so he's just like, all right, you drive. Okay. Got it. Okay, we, so we get it now. <laughs> it works for everybody. 
Except my oh, mom except doesn't, your dad's my mom doesn't trust the uh, GPS yet. I get, I get what do you the, mean she doesn't get trust? get to tweet everywhere. It's great. Wait, what do you mean your mom doesn't trust the GPS? Well, put the navigation in the GPS and it'll tell us the fastest route. And she'll be like, yeah, I'm not going that way. She, she <laughs> argues over it. I like his mom better than I like his dad. I'm just going to say that. <laughs> I like just being like, I don't trust this computer that is literally built to get me somewhere fast. Yeah. Fuck this. Remember having to print out MapQuest? I yes. Love it. That was the best. Just have nine pages. Of yeah, I just you remember through. AAA triptychs? I don't Actually remember that. came like on a little binder. Yeah, I, I remember that. I vividly oh, remember yeah. my dad oh, having ass. a huge actual map when we would like yeah. go on road trips as kids and just being like, what? how the fuck are they doing this? If you think about how a GPS guides us and how we get places now, how did people get somewhere in 1985? Have- he would literally just hold, we would stop to get gas and he would hold out the map and just be like all right i gotta take this to this, to this we would get lost a lot as yes guys. i remember family parties always getting lost like yeah. going to see relatives out in the yeah that's crazy i guess we're a lot smarter then the garments everyone was like super pumped about the garments two little sandbags putting them on the yeah we had yeah. a we had a tom tom I knew you. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. of course you were Tom Tom. Homer Simpson voice. Tom, Tom. Yeah. You can put different voices on. Oh, yeah. You did Homer Simpson? Schwarzenegger. Oh, I like Ooh. that. Ooh. I didn't know you could do that. With da- the- Dana! Come in here. Oh, oh haircut. You looking good, bro. Yeah. yeah. Come say hi. Why did you say that? Sit down. Fresh why? cut. Uh, no, we're not. We're, we're this Thursday's episode. What's up, friends? What's up, Tim? Hey, Dana. How are you? He's chirped me online before. Uh, chirps chirps him? This is the only thing he ever remembers about me, and I've, I've been guilty ever since. He said a lot of nice Tim things. Tim chirps at me all the time. He said a lot of nice what things. What did he say that was mean? I forget. He's just brutally honest, you know? Yeah. Oh, well, he's off. He's drank 17 <laughs> rupees. He's off the, yeah, he's off the A&W. <laughs> yeah. Right now, he's, he's a little wild. <laughs> um, you just now noticed I've the just no, I mean, he doesn't have anything on. I didn't yeah. look at you guys. Why would you? Uh, what is going on? Are you guys doing a case race? Yeah. Seven. You want to make a guest appearance during it? I'm not going to be here, but... You're not working Viva hours tonight? I'm not working Viva hours. Why? And I finished my video early, so I'm going to go home and eat some food, you know? Nice. <laughs> <laughs> are you, uh, where are you living these days? I live on Long Island. Still at the... Oh. Yeah. yeah, come on. <laughs> is, is, is rent good out there? I don't pay a single cent. Yeah, I know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. Have you had to help out yet? Yeah, I do yard work. That's not true. I don't. Yeah. I've done any yard work. Uh, I take the trash out. Okay. Has there been a moment where your girlfriend's dad's like, "Hey, can you help?" <laughs> no, I, dude, I'm very like, I, I proactively, I'm like, "Yo, can I do anything to help?" And they're always like, "No, nah, you're good. You're saving a shit ton of money." Yes. Yeah. Put that's that got to be amazing. That's awesome. I haven't seen you guys in a while on the act, but thanks for having me. What if you just I miss you, man? What if you just you're what big. if you just lived at your girlfriend's parents' house, saved the shitload of money, and then Forever. up with her? I'd <laughs> <laughs> be, that'd be Save so up money hard. for a house and then dump her. <laughs> Stop, dude! Come on, that's yeah. You know this isn't live. What it out? <laughs> kind of a good idea. Oh, no, she's lovely. Good for you, Dane. I'm happy you're doing well. He's you're a means big, to an end, brother. Oh, if you, if you look good. <laughs> you're really big. I saw the bra- you re- broke the record Saturday beers. I'm on Z- I'm on Ozempic. For oh, real? Really? Yeah. Well, still How's it going? It's not bad. I mean, I think I've gained weight. Yeah, I mean, you Jesus, have. How many Jesus calories are in Ozempic? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, when did you start? You took only a, a couple. It's only been a couple weeks. Turns out it makes your did clothes. Did it do anything smaller. to you? I'm on a very low dose right now, so I don't haven't noticed anything. So did it make you feel sick? No, no. I, I might do it. I I haven't felt sick, but I've I've definitely noticed that like my appetite. At certain points, goes just like kind of makes me not want to eat as much. Do you power through it? That's my. Yes, concern. that's the problem. Yeah, I right. Yeah. I, d- it d- I just I eat through the Ozempic. Right. I feel like I can beat Ozempic. Yeah. Are you injecting I, it? So big. Yeah. In your butt. Right in my tummy. Is it no. Oh, you can tomorrow. tell. Yeah. Oh, you're doing it, it just hurt? for weight loss. <laughs> uh, yeah. yeah. Does it yeah. hurt? <laughs> no. It's just like a little. It's a tiny needle. Hmm. I'm probably gonna have people. F- uh, what? Now they're gonna freak me out about side effects. How big you are? What are the side effects? Nothing so far. They're just. I don't understand when people say that about side effects. Isn't like the most dangerous thing to be overweight? Like, yeah. you get yeah. skinny. That's yeah, good. Dude. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Mister Two Seventy Two. We don't need that. Well, people will say like loss of motivation, but you already live at your girlfriend's parents. Right. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> what what what's gonna happen? <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, that's good. That's good. <laughs> Will you let me know how it goes if I, I will. should do I'm, it? I'm three and a, three weeks in, and I've I also want to cons- drop. I have I've dropped like four pounds. I want to stop about using too hot. Yeah, what? you worried about getting too hot? Yeah, yeah. I want to stop using Long nicotine way, way. too. I feel like it will stop that. Stop drinking coffee, which. Come on, dude. What the fuck? Why are you stopping using nicotine? Oh, that was dumb. Yeah, no, that's right. Not that. It's, we're, we're now even for, that was the, stupid. for the my, the master plan of saving all that money. and then. Yeah, no. You, you can chirp me as much as you want. Why are you, are you guys drinking, drinking beer? What time are you guys drinking beers? He's drinking root beers. As soon as I leave. He's drank 18. 7 o'clock. Are you serious? <laughs> yeah. Yes. That's, wait, really? Yeah. I didn't know that was happening. 18 glasses. So, like, 13, no, uh... Nine. 12, 12 full root beers. All right, Tim. Glasses. Is that a cheesecake factory in what, 1998? No. 2000. Uh, 2000. He said 10 years 2013. Ago. 10 years. 2013. You drank how many? 19. A lot. <laughs> TJ was alive in the 90s? I don't know. I don't, I'm not giving the numbers. How old are you, TJ? 24? 26. 26. 26. Oh, fuck. Yes, he was. Wait, so what else is going on? What, what are you working on? Are you doing some travel videos? Yeah, I'm doing a lot of... Uh, I'm basically doing a lot of like back-to-back Saturday, Sunday tailgate videos. Oh, all, which is going to be rough. Tell me the schedule. I'm going to the Bussin Bowl. I'm going to I'll be there. I'm going to a lot of Monday Night Football games, like a Lions Monday Night Football, uh, Jaguars Monday Night. You football. should sit with Detroit Town and Superfan. <laughs> I can't. I can't. Dolphins. Why? That's magic, dude. But still, I will never touch that, dude. That is like gold. That they would not have. Be they would love to have you, though. I know, but. That's you got to go back and, and make that history. What what week is that? It's like the middle of October or something. We should talk. Maybe I will. Yeah. Are you gonna go to uh, Eagles Dolphins? I think that's Monday. No, I'm going to Cowboys the Eagles, which is fucking. That's gonna be a, a shit show. And then I just started. Uh, I sent an email the other day. I'm trying to get a basketball hard knocks in New York, <coughs> the New York office. So. What do you mean? I want to like head up the production of that. What, what team? Like a barstool basketball team. We did that. Yeah, I know, like years ago, but now we have like we have way more cameramen than we did, you know, 2018. So who who's gonna be on the team? It's we're gonna suck, dude. We're gonna be off. Say you have to play. Yeah, I'm gonna play, but oh, I'm also okay. gonna edit it. So and it's like I'm New doing York a little City bit League? of both. Just yeah, like a, yeah. yeah. You gotta get to Julio. Yeah, the Julio is a grind. But are you? Yeah, are you gonna get content people, or are you gonna get? Yes. So you, and no, then there, there's gonna be a content team and a production team. Production team will win. Yes, we suck. Edwin's very good. Yeah. He actually texted me, and he was, like, pissed. He's like, I, I want to be on your team. And I was like, I want to have a bad team. Right. So who else have... is going to be? Is Clemmer? Yeah, Clemmer. Mm-hmm. Oh. I want Joey to play. Oh, no. Pat's playing. Pat's good. He's good. Pat's good, yeah. Marty. Um, <laughs> obviously. Uh. Rico? Rico. I think it'll be good. I've always wanted to do that. That's my passion. Basketball. Basketball, Basketball is my passion. Right, I'm only you had a nothing else. Yeah. Uh, office. Getting boring. I'm getting boring. You're not. Only, no. uh, only you had an office with a court. Yeah. Basketball court. You did invite me. Yeah, I did. Very, pretty I early beat, on. I can't beat free rent. It would be a long commute. <laughs> you. I can't beat yeah. free rent. That's yeah, a game there's, changer. There's other factors involved, you know. How do you have free right? rent? What? How do you have free rent? Oh, you missed it. <laughs> <laughs> We're roasting me. I live at my girlfriend's parents' house. Oh, shit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, they're wonderful people. Where's sure your girlfriend? That sounds like worst case. Yeah. Oh, dude, we have our own little like. That area. sounds like something went wrong. We have our own. I'd hope you'd have a your we own, have our own area. What the fuck? No, like our whole. We got a back room. Yeah, you got the, the back bunk bottom, beds. You got the bottom. You get like good dinners every night. <laughs> no, we usually we usually eat out. Yeah. Ah, oh, that'd so. be awesome. We got a yard. Yeah, Dana? we got dogs. Dinner. <laughs> Before it gets cold, Dana. <laughs> Your vegetables. <laughs> Dude, that would suck if you got grounded. <laughs> yeah. It actually is a testament to to the parents because I. Oh, I know. Like the idea of you living in my house. Well, actually, a funny story. Uh, <laughs> like, uh, one like of the you, you've made it in life. You have a nice home. Get into retirement age, and then Dana shows up. <laughs> hey guys. <laughs> Well, all right, so me and her her uh, dad are pretty tight, and then I remember a funny story once was, like, he just started watching Barstool stuff because of me, and it was the dozen, and we were playing you, and you just you start off on the big screen. It's the three of us, and it just goes, there's the king of blowjobs. <laughs> <laughs> Did he have the same question? Was he, like, giving or taking? Uh, silent. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> that was tough. 
That's all right. Then they get numb to it. Yeah, then they get numb to it. Yeah. It just becomes whatever. All right. See you, Dana. All right. Miss you, Dana. See you, Tim. Good seeing you. Hi, Dana. Uh, It's Dana Beers, everyone. He's top three for making me laugh. Yeah, he's so funny. He's a funny guy. We should have had him on the case race. (coughs) Oh, yeah. He said that he's got to go home. And his word count from the last one was, I think, like five. Yeah. Yeah. He's got to go home and and, uh, do some yard work. Why are you quitting uh, nicotine? I was just, he's on Ozempic. Oh, really? So I was asking him questions because I'm thinking about doing it. I'm trying to diet the right way right now. But I was thinking about how one of the side effects is getting one of the cravings. Yeah, would yeah. be nice. And quitting nicotine, people normally gain weight. Right. When they yeah. quit. Right. Yeah. David Tell has a joke where he's talking about, he's talking about, he's talking about child porn oh. and how, uh, and how they, how the, how pedophiles say it's an addiction. He's like they're si- like it's similar to smoking, and he's like, "Well, I smoke a pack and a half a day." He's like, "I don't really know what's that translate to in boy." <laughs> <laughs> and, then, and then he's like, "And then he's like, then you got to think about it. He's like, if I quit, am I going to gain weight?" And he's <laughs> very funny bit. That was awkward. <laughs> yeah. Well, I think I lost you guys at the child porn. Yeah. <laughs> oh, really you had me through that. Man. I didn't see it coming. I gotta say. Funny joke though. It is. What does that translate to in boy? <laughs> Where did Rico go? Uh, he he was never on this, on this episode. Yeah, he wasn't on this so episode. So he's just sitting out there with face paint on? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Should we spin the wheel? Yeah, let's yeah. do it. We're getting close to the 20 mark. What do, What should we actually... I'm like so impressed It's 13 this. cans he's done. Holy shit. That's so much soda. That is so Sink. much soda. 13 cans. Awful. So that's 20... You want to get to 14 cans? You want to finish one more can? Whatever you want. Okay. You're a beer guy, too. What's the, the most What's the most beers you ever put back, you think? Fuck, man. Not, not this many. That's not this many, yeah. What's happening? You've definitely had 13. Let's go to fi- yeah. Let's go 15. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. 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 I think 15 cans is a good amount, so we'll do two more cans. Well, that's the Jeez. good job. It's like the worst possible way to do that. <laughs> I didn't want to use my hands. He used his hand, your hands when he wasn't in here. He didn't see me use my hands. Did you wash your hands? Today has clean no hands. Point. Today Did I have washed my hands, yes. And have you peed since then? Oh, yeah. Yeah, for sure. Did you wash your hands? At some point today, I Damage washed my hands. Damage is already done. You already, you already, you you already, already drank already, all You've already 20 root beers. You went to go pee. A little, a little pee down. hands. I already in, put... I already put Put the ice in. Really? Yeah. Okay. It's fine. I'm. Okay, come on. It's what is it? My penis is clean. Let's see. No. Uh. Oh, what I heard. Oh shit. Yeah. I heard you had a dirty, dirty. That's true. That's true. But this is not a flare up right now. No, no, no. Not as. It's just muddy. <laughs> you can settle down after you put them back in the cooler. Oh look at this. He's stone colding them. Woo. That's twenty. Jesus. So this will be he will he will have drank fifteen cans of holy <laughs> shit. Now Tim, you said you want you, your dream is to have a wet wheel today. Yeah, I brought clothes just in case. But you've already changed. This is Why big. Change again. This will be the funny. This will be the best carbone group. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I had enough clothes so that if I went to the bathroom fifteen times, I would have a new outfit. Okay. So, oh, Aww. love that. <laughs> All right, come on, Tim. Come on, Tim. He's been hoping for it every oh, day. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, oh. Tim. All right. He did it. That's incredible. Wow. He's literally been oh, tweeting boy. about it every day. Oh, boy. Did well, that really happen? To him? Yeah. yeah, so we just... Dana's on it. Dana's on it. Dana's we'll on give it. it to Tim? Go get Dana. Go oh, get no, Kelly. No. Go get oh, Kelly. Oh, Kelly. That's right. Go get Kelly. <laughs> oh. All right. You just made me so happy. Oh, Thank you. I'm happy. I'm happy that you're happy. Although I did have some name wheel stuff as well. Oh. Just in case. You had your own, your own slivers? Absolutely. Can you drop a couple? No. Okay. You got to save it for the next okay, time. Okay, next oh. time. TJ has them. Fair enough. Fair enough. All right, Let's who else was on the show today? 20 root beers. Um, Dana. It was just Dana just and, Dana and Jay. Kelly, right? Kelly. Yeah. Make sure Che's on there. This is going to suck if someone who got their face painted has to go wet. 
I just don't know what I'm going to do. I, like, I'll have to. I hope I get wet for the group. I hope, hope I, I get wet for the group. I hope I get wet for yeah, the group. Yeah, I hope you get wet for the group. All right, TJ. Question, and I love her. I don't want to do this. Is Mrs. Hitchings on the wheel? Oh, <laughs> yes. Yeah, she's saying yes. <laughs> she's thumbs up. The Hitchings are okay. ride or die. They're the best. They're all in. <laughs> They're ride or die. All right, TJ, you want to start the spinning? <sighs> I think you can, if if you get it, you can you can get your body, not your face. I can champion for my mom. Okay. Well, she's the one that raised her hand. Okay. Connor, would you like to champion for anyone? Oh, we do. Okay. Who's going to champion for me? I'll but do whoever. Champion for people when her name's on there twice? Yeah. No, but if if Connor would like to take it for someone who has okay. face pain, he can. All right. Oh, we'll just put a bag over her head. <laughs> Ellie's going to be so mad if she gets it. What is she going to do? What color am I? I cannot see that far. Blue. Which blue? Royal blue. Arc. Royal. I'm so happy that you got this, Tim. I saw you tweeting. You're the me. royal blue. Two weeks, Tim was tweeting. Yeah, but hope the odds are, are terrible. I can actually do this. Oh, man. I would have gotten wet, too. You would have loved to. Would have loved to. Painted. Shit, guys. Just complaining how dry you were. I was. Oh. All that mud and muck off your penis. That sucks. Don't. Oh. EJ. No man should see his son get wet. <laughs> <laughs> Who's dad? <laughs> <laughs> <It's me. Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, oh my word! Road, what the fuck, oh, dude? What is that? Track. What is that? It's just a fucking team face. <laughs> she <had> awesome. <laughs> left. What the fuck? Did you not know she wasn't giving you Shrek? <laughs> dude, you're gonna get green screened. We should have a whole movie playing. Oh yeah. <laughs> Wait, yeah. Your, your face paint should be the entire Shawshank Redemption during the <laughs> Quigs MLB <Yeah>. highlights. <laughs> Ron, you look really, and I mean this as a friend, like you look really good green. Yeah, you do. Like it does something for you. You feeling okay? Oh, man. You just got <laughs> off the coast, <laughs> roller coaster tag team. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh my god. Holy <laughs> 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 fuck. Oh, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> you had so many colors. That was so you fast shot. from TJ. Oh my god. <laughs> TJ, do you have a shortcut for that? Oh <laughs> you can god. you can auto key out green and that's <laughs> that's oh. the default. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh fuck! Can I see a replay oh, of that. No. <laughs> <laughs> I, I have do. a feeling you will. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny, Sass, because uh, I got I, I got you back, brother. If you want to play that game, <laughs> oh <laughs> yeah, yeah. true, brother. Yeah, yeah, that's true. No uh, CGI. <laughs> you got wet wheel. Perfect. Yeah, Tim was <laughs> so happy. He was so happy. Uh, <laughs> Perfect for me. Okay. Oh man. Run well. to get summoned right here. I was going to order a bagel. Do you want one, bro? Bagel? I just had a turkey sandwich with a Kaiser roll. Soak that shit up. Kill for a bagel. Oh, Kelly knows that she's on it. Slow down. Sassy, way to be, boy. I'll come get me. Proud of you, Sassy. Chill. Mm. Where are you going? What? Why? We got wet wheel. Just wait two seconds. Wait. Dana is safe. He's literally standing up in there. No one's even sitting. They're looking at me. It's five on the dot right now. You want anything, Ron? You good? Thank you. Just kill for a bagel. You want one, Sass? Oh yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> I was I was looking after my my teammate. What do you want? You want to bacon, egg, and cheese? Sure. Oh shit, it's closed. Lexi. That's Kelly, what do we Kelly? It's off. She would have, she would have. She said, I will take the punishment for all New oh, York Damn, you're out. Ah, uh, damn. It would count as drinking one if so you pour one on your head. 
I should have had extra slices on there as a guest. You can volunteer as tribute if Sask gets it. I'll volunteer if my wife gets it. That's what I'll do. Man, there she is. I just want to ride home. Where do we go now? Where do we go? Where do we go now? Hi, Brandon. Sweet child. <laughs> Sweet child. I'm like the mask. Yeah, you look like the mask. <laughs> All right, so it's going to be me or Za. Wow. Baby, calm down. Za, traditionally known as the driest in the office. Today, it was the act. first ever driest. I don't think I'm ever going to get wet again. No backup clothes. So you know that means I'm getting wet. It's the score right now. One nothing, Za. Oh no, Roan. Baby, come down. So what should I do? Plastic bag overhead? Plastic yeah. bag overhead. I have. Okay, 1-1. One, one. Plastic bag overhead. Take your shoes off, Ron. Yeah. It's over. Plastic bag overhead, and then uh, I'm going to change shirts for the wet wheel, and then change back into the shirt. Well, you're going to get green all over that shirt, though. So we're tra changing out. Oh, to and you take it off. Yeah. I might be able to widen it. I like how mine is green, though. That's apropos two to one, but I know how that should go. Yeah, you never want the 2-1 lead. Ever. Worst lead in sports. Yeah, my brother. Oh. What are oh. you at? Want to go to the bathroom? Dangerous. Dangerous. Look at that show. stack of cans. Score right now? Three to one, me. So. All right, let's go, Roan. No. Let's go, Roan. Oh no, Za, Za, I, I do not trust Za coming back. For the oh, here we go. Three shit, to two. Here it comes. That fucking three one. God damn it. Here it comes. God bless America. Do you yeah. want to go four? Want to shout out the troops? Want four? Or do you want to the troops? Shout out to the troops. Smartest guys we got. Fuck. All right, three three. Wait. Oh, wrong. I don't want to see my boy have to do this before we got to compete in there's the a, arena. There's a plastic bag I could throw over my head. It's got to be. Oh. Yeah. oh, no. What a comeback. Wow. Damn, wrong. Oh, wrong. Yak shirt. Put on one of those shirts in there, yeah. And then put the bag on. What about the bucket? Get, you don't have to get your hair. Just get, get your body. You put the bucket over your head? I don't your know body. Help. Mm. Hi, Adam. The green really is flattering on him. He looks great. He looks great green. I feel bad I keep coughing. I think I have like an ass. Oh! Did Brandon just fall? Was that? <laughs> Going Man. in with a purpose. Is this our last show in studio with one another? Case race will be. Oh, yeah. I oh, forgot yeah, about that race. in an hour. So that'll be a lot of uh, emotion dumping. Sure. I'm very excited that Rico is part of it. Yeah. What are we going to play once we're drunk? Salad bowl? I think we do. Uh, Celebrity guesser? Yeah. Till we Celebrity get guesser. Till we get it. Salad bowl's a good time, though. We should play one round of salad bowl. It is fun. It yeah, is I'd love fun. to see Rico. Oh, oh yeah. I want to just watch him do everything. Mm hmm. Agreed. What are we zooming in on? I think Frank's on deck. Oh, oh wow. Oh, Roan no. got in there. Roan. Roan got in Just there right the on time. time. Holy shit. Oh, no, he's not even in there yet. He's holding them up. Smart. I'm very oh, happy. Did that, he? I'm happy that Tim got that. He wanted that so bad. He experienced the rush of it. He was tweeting all week saying that he's hoping there's no wet wheel. Part of me was like, we should have a medic on hand. Like, that's a lot of root beer. And he doesn't seem phased in any way. I think he's been sneaking RBs behind the wife's back every once in a yeah. while. That's an mm. experienced uh, root beer. I mean, look at that. He's not generally a quantity guy either. Like, he drinks beer, but it's usually like one or two beers, and then he's good. Yeah, like, he's like a quality craft beer guy. Right. He's it's just, like it's a... just for the taste. He's not drinking for right. to get hammered. My goodness. 15. So why 15 when he, when he cans. Pulls out the 15 RB. You gotta, Holy 15 cans. It's an insane amount of root beer. 
He's got one to finish to get 15 full cans. He just he just did another costume change. He's just doing free promo. How much did Buddha Ben pay you? <laughs> <laughs> we now know what's happening. Do you have every piece that he's put out? Not quite. Uh, I like that one. All right, so if you finish this, then you've officially drank 15 cans, 22 root beers is what we're calling it. That's impressive. And I can go? And then you can go. <laughs> and then you can go. A lot of you leave. got your wet wheel. I'm happy you did. I'm not it's, been a, it's been a pleasure. I'm happy. I wanted to get wet. I got the, the clinking of the glass has been a nice, like, uh, I like relaxing it. sound. It too. is. It's a good sound. Yeah, it's good. Nice little. Is there any any wisdom or anything you'd like to impart on us? Now about drinking hit, root beer? Oh, about, no, you've hit your goal. I don't know. TJ's an impressive guy. I feel like you guys done good. Is so far. Any? So, so far. Fuckers. What about? Any? Do you feel a little bad that every You're time? You're going to have a great basketball team. All right. So the football team's not going to win anything. Uh, that was what that was. That was what that was. Are you? Do you feel a little bit hurt that every time this conference realignment comes up, you guys are used as the... Oregon's got to go to Piscataway. That's always the conversation. Like, could you imagine Washington playing Rutgers? It's disdain. Does it hurt you? Yeah, of course it hurts. Okay, yeah. it's nothing you can do about it, but yeah, you're you're until they come in and play, and we'll see what happens. Well, they'll probably win. Can't win every game. Mm-hmm. Usually, those teams win every game against Rutgers. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I do, I will say this. If Rutgers ever gets good again, like it is my nightmare to, for Wisconsin to lose in football to Rutgers, because I know that like even though we beat you every single time we play, if you win one, then TJ's got that over me. Forever. Yeah, that's my dream. Yeah, right. Absolutely. Yeah, no, I dread that. Watching you suffer a little. Yeah, I dread fun. that. I dread that. It's like Purdue fans if because we know you're going to put yeah. money on yeah. it too, right? Yeah. Shit. A lot of money. Yeah. That's coming out of TJ's salary. Right. It's the new bar stool. TJ gets paid. TJ gets paid. Oh. Wait, you're not TJ. getting good gifts from TJ? Not really. What the fuck? got you an arcade uh, machine last year. He got you an arcade machine? That's, uh, fuck? Fuck? Machine? Oh, that's a good hat. That's a good hat. It's a great hat. TJ, did you use your discount to get that hat? No, I didn't even know that we actually had that until that email got sent out to Oh, wow. We have a discount? Yeah, 30%. they changed the code. Is that, did they give us the 30% discount because they're taking away all of our benefits and everything now? Everything's yeah. gone. <laughs> Everything. Oh, my God. <laughs> Patrick Bateman over here. <laughs> oh, you look uh, like American Psycho. <laughs> he is soaking wet. Yeah, he's the wettest. Sopping. Oh, wettest. fuck. That's rules. It's probably oh, and have you been lifting have or something? His, his body looks great. Frank you point. look awesome, dude. Is that yoga? Pilates? Have you been doing Pilates? No, it's a wet shirt. <laughs> you look awesome. I noticed it in a Pat Bev clip. His arms look big. The shirt getting wet is really what does it. I have no backup clothes. Um, I can give you some. It's okay. All right, Tim, f- chug that beer and root beer, and then we bid you adieu. <sighs> 15 cans. This man drank 15 cans. Chug, 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 chug. Chug, chug, and that's big hey. beers. What a hero! Are you disappointed that I didn't throw up? Uh, I thought. You oh, were I was going to there. I actually never thought you'd throw up. I really didn't. I did. I've changed my opinion of you. Uh, you're a winner. Ian? No, you've you've been a winner for for me for months. You we've had that conversation. Not personally, but I've heard it on the air. I think I said that. Maybe I said it to your wife. <laughs> She and I talk all the time. All the time. Yeah. She drives me around. (laughs) I made it on the Christmas card. You did. You're a winner. You got to get another one for this year's Christmas card. Oh, yeah. Maybe today. Yeah. Well, Tim, any last words? Thank you very much. Yeah, this has been. the honor and the privilege. You're a good hang. Very good hang. This was legendary. I want to do f- five more cans right now just for the shit of it. <laughs> oh. You want me to leave you with some root beer? Are you thirsty? No, no. I just didn't know if uh, to call your call. Oh. All right. Well, Tim, thank you. Thank you. One of the last yaks you've ever done in this studio. It was, it was a pleasure having you in here. Appreciate it. Hope to see you in the new studio. Yes, absolutely. You're always welcome. Yes. Always welcome. Thank you. 
All right, we'll see everyone for the case race on Friday. Please like and subscribe. See you then. Oh. Say bye. See you tomorrow. Bye. We love you all.